it's starting to stream again. Hello? Hello. Hello. Audio's good. Alright. Hey, what's going on, YouTube? It is. Your boy. His. Oh, yep. Yep. It's on. Okay. Oh, we got. Bro, we got Rataz, number one. Congratulations. Get the number one spot. Sweet. Hi. Is it Death Counter? Why is the Death Counter not on? I think it'll turn on later. Anyway, let's continue where we left off. Then last time we left off, right? Um, my game was crashing a bunch. So, um, all day yesterday, I decided to... No, not like all day, but you know what I mean. I spent quite a few hours yesterday just doing nothing but just testing my game. And I, was, I removed a bunch of mods. Turns out... Uh, <laughs> um, the reason why the why the laser gun was so overpowered was due to like this one mod I forgot to uninstall. I was testing it out called Direct Hit, and Direct Hit is like it's like a realistic damage overhaul. And I combined that with my mod, so like everyone was dying super quickly. And like the energy weapons especially were like really overpowered for some reason with that mod. So, I uninstalled it now. Everything's back to normal. Everything's back to normal balancing now. You know? And I... Um, I I, was, I even, like, went through the arc jet systems and I was able to clear it out. But that was on the test run. So, now we're going to do that live. You know? Well, actually, before I do that, I might as well go to the vault and go get Nick. Why not? So, that's what we're going to do. We're going to head on over to the vault. And I will not crash this time. Where's my damn bot at? Why is my counter not working? I need my death counter, my crash counter. It only turns on when the bot gets here. It's not here yet. Mm -hmm. If you're reading this, say cheese. Cheese. Yo, Brandy, you good now? Yeah. The game, the game should be better. You know, when I was, I was playing through it yesterday, I was able to play a solid hour with no crashes. Which is good. But there is no guarantee, because, I mean, my game's... They're still going to crash. Oh, yeah. There was another thing I forgot to mention. Um, I changed my memory settings back to the other one, and that works a lot better. But it's it's still likely that my game's going to blow up, because, you know. And these stairs are still bugged, but whatever. I don't know what causes that. You know, I should... Because <laughs> with my mod list, man, I have been using the same... I've been building upon this mod list for, like, years. I should honestly just go back and just, like, redo it and start from scratch. Because I have so much junk just added in here that it, that doesn't need to be here, you know? I cannot lie. This, like, stuff like that. Like, why are these people glowing red? There's no reason I missed, too. Oh, yeah. That's another thing. I added in the floating damage mod as, like, a debugging tool to make sure that my, that my guns are doing the correct amount of damage. You know? Nice. Okay. Play Minecraft, mine diamonds. Damn, that was a that was a heavy swing. See so if you get the headshot with the melee, because like I'm not sure, I'm not sure people know this, but um, the melee weapons in this game you can get headshots with them. So that's why I was able to one shot that pale head right there with the pickaxe. I mean, it makes sense, you know. You hit someone in the head with their freaking pickaxe. I think they're gonna die. Very balanced. What was that? quad shot shotgun oh yeah the, the 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 quad shot laser shotgun don't worry guys I, I i got rid of that i got rid of that other mod that was causing the issue the the quad shotgun the quad laser shotgun is not overpowered anymore it it's it's not gonna one shot me i tested it you know it was just it was really weird <laughs> where are these irons there's no rear sights on this thing that looks stupid Oh, I don't know if I can kill this. No. No, I'm going to have to run. No, thank you. <laughs> Let's see. Dude, he's still... There's two of them! Okay. Oh! <laughs> can you reload any slower? 
of course, and I get a little SMG. This is not- okay. I need to find something else. Or not find something else. I just need to get lucky. Ooh, globe. Is there like a ghoul over here I can smoke? That'd be great. <laughs> An absolutely good looking Chad. Thank you. Appreciate it. I'm just gonna run around in circles. Okay. I haven't lost them yet. Hold on. One thing I was gonna check. Oh, wait. Do I have any level ups? Uh, let me get that and that. That's good. Uh, as well as Action Boy. Where's Action Boy at? There we go. Definitely need to remember to level up. Okay. See ya. Oh. Oh, dude. That was some bad accuracy right there. I, I just mag dumped and missed like half my shots. Another machine pistol! Hold up. I need to add ammunition for it. Whoops. Of course I ran it. Let me just go melee this guy. <laughs> I'll add ammo for it later. Okay, that works. Oh, there we go! Why is he... Just, okay. This is a bit hectic. Damn! They, they call him a feral tank for a reason, I guess. Woo! <laughs> he broke my armor, but he did hit me. What an absolute tank. There we go, right in the face. That was a good one. Whew. That's what I was waiting for. Ooh, grenade launcher, okay. That was sweet. Ooh, heavy play. That's ooh, that's really nice. That's what I need. Since when did you do a face reveal? A couple days ago. I just hopped on stream. I was like, I'll put on my webcam. I didn't make a big deal out of it. I was like, I don't want to be like Dream or something to make a big deal. Like, who cares, bro? I'm just going to hop on stream, put on the camera, and just act like normal. Because there's no reason for me to make it a huge freaking event. Like it's the Super Bowl or something. You know, that would just be silly. I feel like that's really like narcissistic to do like... Like doing a face reveal with a whole 20 minute video. Hyping it up. You know, like it's a whole sporting event. I'm like, dude, who cares? Just... <laughs> it's silly. But I can see why if you're like if you're like a big YouTuber with like like just like like Dream, like I was saying, like that's a good example. I can understand to a certain extent because he's he's just simply such a humongous YouTuber. But for me, I'm like, I don't care. Oh. Blinded by the light. Okay. I guess I was going to the metro with this thing. What's my most important mod? Obviously, it's my mod. <laughs> no. Um, I don't know. There's a lot of good mods. It's, that's what I'm saying. When you're running hundreds of mods, it's hard to say which one's the most important. I would say the, the Casio watch is the best one, obviously, because it gives you a little little wristwatch. I actually have a Casio. That's why I like that mod so much. They're, they're just so so simple and stylish, you know? I'm telling you. Very cheap, too. Doing it skinny, bro. And they last forever. It was the best decision we ever made. It was the best decision we ever made. Blows up. <laughs> nice. Oh, I got the Karam bit. This guy's crippled. I can get him. Oh, no. His buddy has a machine gun. Don't worry. I'll hide behind him. <laughs> that was genius. Oh. Ooh, no scope. See, now I can actually tank some shots, too, which is nice. Like, I did take qu quite a few bullets. I don't- I'm literally pointing to my screen right there. If you look over there, where my health bar is at. I'm below half health from that encounter. Like, my mod isn't, like, hyper-realistic, but it has some realism to it, because you, you can still tank some bullets. It's like a really- it's like a- it's like a really low time to kill first person shooter game, basically. Dude. You know. And plus I'm wearing armor too, so that definitely helps. So that's definitely gonna help solve a lot of issues. Um, I'm not gonna be getting one shot by a laser gun anymore. The balancing is back to how I intended it. You know, so the game isn't gonna be quite as difficult, sadly. Still gonna be difficult, you know, especially if I get the paddle ball. That's gonna suck balls. But... So for like the first like four hours of my playthrough, I was playing on nightmare difficulty. <laughs> Unintentionally, I didn't even know it. 
I was wondering, I was like, this can't be right, dude. I should not be getting one shot by these synths. You know? But like I said, I just had to uninstall. It's literally... That was perfectly horizontal. That should have unlocked it. That's... That's rigged. Nice. Really don't need all this junk. I'm just doing it out of habit. It's your favorite weapon mod? So I get that a lot. I mean, shoot, something like the MP5 is really good. It has such good animations. Pretty much anything by FX001, the MP5 and the Mark 18 are like some of the best gun mods out there. His animations are so clean, man. Like, like I'll just switch real quick to show you. But like, damn, bro, that's kind of dark. You can't really see. Uh, that's better lighting. You can see the side of the gun. Just absolutely amazing animations on this thing, man. Especially the slap. Oh, wait. Okay, this one's using the... There's two different animations for this one. One of them has a slap. This one's just like a little... Whatever that thing is. The other one's way better. Anyway, let's go back to the big machine gun. The Type... Type 11? This is a really goofy one. Some goofy World War One machine gun. This guy said I should undo my face reveal like Dream. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna be like going out of my way to post all my my face in all my videos, but I'm not gonna undo it. That'd be silly. Like in the in the uh, the video, like in the I'm gonna make a video of the stream. Obviously, in the video, I'll include most of the most of the uh, most of the videos gonna be what you see here on the stream overlay. You know, so you can see like why is my freaking bot still not online? I, my my counters are still not working. Give me a second, guys. Why is my bot still not online, bro? I just realized that. I looked over and I was like, my overlay's not on. It's kind of silly. Maybe I should refresh it. Hold on. Hold on. Cause I, hold on. My overlay's not working. I just got some donations right there. Give me a second. I'll get to that in just one second, guys. Maybe I should just try refreshing it, I guess. Uh, I don't know. It's kind of weird. I'll worry about that later. It's not a huge deal, but kind of, kind of annoying. I haven't watched the last stream. Oh, there it is. <laughs> well, that, that's Zach. I didn't show Conzilla's donation though. That shit's really delayed. Anyway, um, haven't watched the last stream, but damn, bro, sick hair. Also, I wish you ein guten Tag, mein Freund. What does that mean? I wish you a good day, my friend. See, I know German. Are you German, Conzilla? Is that why you said that? I mean, that would probably make more sense. You know. But anyway, thank you very much for the 50 bucks, man. That's a that's a big one. That's the biggest donation so far in this uh, whole playthrough. Awesome, bro. Thank you very much. And then we got a second one from Zach right there. Zach said, um, I dubbed the Gamer Jesus. <laughs> that's funny. I've been, getting, uh, I've been getting a lot of comments like that. It's like calling me like Fallout Jesus. Like there's, there's, um, there's Gun Jesus, right? The Forgotten Weapons. And, uh, and I'm Fallout Jesus, I guess. That's funny. Thank you very much for the 10 bucks, Zach. Really appreciate that. The 10, or... It's not American dollars, but whatever that is. Thank you very much. Oh, wait. Whoops. I just forgot which gun I was using. Should I reload my save? I think I just cheated. I was, like, I was just, like, mindlessly shooting. Let me just reload my save, because I... Whoops. <laughs> Whoopsie. That's funny. No, you guys, you guys didn't see that. I'm telling you, joining Let's just do this again. I like the grenade launcher. It's funny. Oh, I got the punt gun. Can I? Oh, oh no! I got the, the, the thirst zapper. This is gonna do no damage. I got a critical hit. I did a critical hit. Okay, I'll just I'll just take that L. <laughs> the thirst ever. It doesn't even have like the explosive attachment either. It's just the regular water, so it's just a guaranteed death. <laughs> See, okay, if I there we go. Now the counter is working. See, I have to actually type something in for the overlay to work. That's stupid. Anyway, so that's fixed. That's good. It was the best decision we ever had. <laughs> Get shot in the head by a forty millimeter grenade launcher. Ow. 
Oh, I got the shy tech M200 intervention. Let's go. You gotta say the whole thing. Very awesome. It's Jover. How did you lose to the third sapper? It's the best gun of the game. I mean, I'm just bad at the game, obviously. I have a, se I have a <laughs> severe skill issue, as you can tell. Oh! Oh! A thousand damage! Jeez! That's realistic. Man, they weren't lying, bro. That 45 ACP is so strong, it can decapitate a man. <laughs> That's hilarious, bro. <laughs> Did I, I honestly it hasn't showed up in the overlay yet, but whatever. I see it in the chat, so let's see here. Oh, it says chat disconnected. Lag? Lag? Lags? Lags? A lot of lag. Okay, we're good now. Stream's back. No more lag? Okay, now it should open the overlay. I don't know. I mean, I changed my settings to where it's it's streaming at 1080p now. Um, so I don't know what the internet problem is, really. Um, I don't like it now, man. Maybe there's something in my settings I could change. If you guys have any tips, please let me know. Because obviously, I'm not an expert at streaming. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing, bro. I'm just pressing buttons, you know. But anyway, like I was going to say, I got five bucks there for my boy Zim the Despot. Very cool. Thank you very much for the five bucks. Really appreciate that. He said, I wish Fallout had more hunting caliber weapons like 243, 270, or 257 instead of just 308. I mean, in general, I wish Fallout 4 had more calibers. You know, like, kind of like, like, the camera just unfocused. Hello. Focus back in. That's better. Hey. Hey, guys. What's up? This webcam's not too bad. It's all right. But anyway, like I was saying, like, I wish Fallout 4 had more calibers like New Vegas because, um... You know, they just dumb things down for Fallout 4, which is really irritating. You, like, you, you expect the, you expect them to... Oh, wait, I don't want to do that. You expect them to expand upon their mechanics, but they just dumbed it down, you know? Like, every single gun uses the same ammunition. Like, ugh, seriously? Like, come on, man. It's very silly. Let me do a quick save here. And that's why I play with the, you know, the Caliber Complex mod. It adds in a bunch. Although, I will admit... All those caliber names you just listed, I don't have in my game. Because it's like, there comes a point where it's like, it's a little bit redundant to have too many calibers that are very similar, you know? Like, I would actually disagree and say you don't really need that many, like, hunting rifle calibers. Like, because 308 and 270, 243, it's like all like the same thing. So, like, might as well just have 308, you know? But you do want differ to differentiate with other calibers, like 4570, you know? Because you can have more unique weapons of that type, like the hunting revolver, right? Makes sense. Or like something like, it would be nice if they had, um, if they had like higher caliber than just 308, because it's from 308 and then 50 BMG. It's a humongous jump. Like, bro, that's a humongous jump right there. So it'd be nice if they had, like in my game, I have 300 Winchester and 338 Lapua. Those are like the bigger rifle cartridges in between 50 and 308, which is nice. But... I like keep I like to keep it kind of simple while still having good variety. A little bit of an in between. Let me go knife this dude. I need to stop talking so much and actually go. Oh, punt gunning in. Let's go. That didn't kill him. What? What's the spread on this thing? It does like three. It does like three hundred damage in total. Can I shoot? There we go. Okay, he's dead. He's not. I got the finger gun. <laughs> I got the finger gun, bro. That's funny. <laughs> Let's go kill someone with the finger gun, guys. Okay, this is... <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> Get a critical... Ooh, a critical headshot. Did 40 damage. Let's go. <laughs> Yo, I'll, get him, I'll get him eventually, guys. I'm gonna kill this man. Okay, that didn't work. I was trying to kill that man with my mind, bro. I was trying to go like... You know? <laughs> That mod is so funny, bro. I'm glad I added that one to the list. <laughs> Wait. Where does that gun shoot? Uh, the punt gun, it shoots like a humongous something. With like a punt. It's like. It's like a birdshot gun. Like there's like 50 pellets or something. It, the spread should be a lot bigger than what it is, so I should probably go fix that. 
It's not shooting a slug, because the, the punt gun is like, it's actually a hunting weapon for shooting like a, a whole flock, an entire flock of birds, which is so funny. Like, I had one of my viewers recommend to, recommend me to use the weapon, because there, because there's a, there's, there, there's that mod for it. He, he said, he said, Brandy, I want you to do an entire run with this gun. And I haven't gotten around to it, and I probably never will, because I think that'd be boring to just do that one gun, but... I made sure to include it in the weapon randomizer, though. It is pretty funny when it shows up. It's such a goofy, oversized gun. It's actually a lot bigger in real life, too. It's actually it's literally like artillery. That's how big it is. Oh, did I put anything in the death counter? I think I forgot. Let me go and put the... I didn't put the last death in the counter. I might die here again, too, so, uh... Let's see. Let's see if I die here. I'm just gonna hide in this corner. I got the finger gun again, too, so that's, that's great. That's, that's cool. Let me s one damage. <laughs> I don't. I don't think I'm gonna survive this one. I can't even aim. Two damage, guys. <laughs> oh my goodness. How am I supposed to? <laughs> this is so stupid. Don't worry, I'll get him eventually. I'll just keep peeking him. Nine damage. Okay. Got a little headshot on him. That's pretty good. A <laughs> little sound effect. What, 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 what? Missing only has 12 rounds in the magazine? That's pretty bad. I mean, is this thing even using a magazine? I'm just cracking my knuckles whenever I reload. <laughs> what are the chances I get this thing... I get this thing twice in a row like that? Like, come on now. That's just not fair. I'll get him eventually, man. Oh, see, they're shooting each other now. Genius. Yeah, these animations are dope. Okay. This. <laughs> I'll get. I'll get someone eventually. Oh! What? He's one HP. He's one. His teammate killed him. Fuck. That's another thing I added. There's a mod that that en enables friendly fire between NPCs, and he just stole the kill by accident. He killed his buddy with a shotgun. What is he using? Some kind of like. It must be the AA-12. It's a full auto shotty. Wow, forty did. Who would win? A fully automatic AA-12 or some guy using his finger as a gun? <laughs> you know? That's so funny. Okay. I mean, yeah, whenever I get that gun... That gun, you know? That thing is... Kind of like a guaranteed death, almost. Damn. There we go. Oh, right shield. Let's go, baby. So look, it actually does work, see? They're shooting my shield. And it's just shaking my- Oh, he shot him! He shot his teammate in the back! I wanna see if they just kill each other, that'd be funny. <laughs> he killed his teammate! <laughs> They're just shooting each other, they're so stupid. They, they can't get me, I'm invincible. Look at this. Oh, wait, oh. Never mind. I guess some of the shots do go through. Might be a little bit bugged, but it was working mostly. Most of the shots did get blocked. Uh, but that's another death there. <laughs> anyway, let's try that again. Oh, come on. Mouser? Oh, this one's not invisible. Should be doing a little bit more damage. What's the range? Let me check the range stat on this thing. Yeah, it's really low. It should be higher. That's one of the big issues I notice is like if the range stat can be really, really low in some of these gun mods, which is really weird. So, like, I'm doing... Okay, one shot that guy, though. Headshot, nice. Ooh, plasma cannon, for plasma... Uh, gun. Oof! Nice. Oh, I got a freaking little pocket knife. That's not good. I can still get this guy. We get a bob and weave. Okay, maybe... I can't blank. Oh, headshot. There we go, baby. Oh. Ooh! Let me just... There we go. Also, I don't know what the... freaking audio bug is for. MP443. Damn. It's like, this gun should be doing a little bit more damage. Are you kidding me? Die. Just die already. Come on. 
that, so that guy was taking a lot of bullets for some reason. Oh. Oof. Right in the face. Got him. Oh, cha-ching. Let's go. Another, don another donation there for my boy, Neo, with the $5. Thank you very much, Neo. I really appreciate that. He said, I have returned, Brandy. And I noticed you look like Post Malone if he played Bethesda games instead of Apex. What? I've never gotten Post Malone before. Is it the face shape, maybe? I'm going to look at a picture at Post Malone. Let me see. Is it the face shape and the beard? Oh, oh yeah, he has a very similar beard. Okay, yeah, and he has a similar face shape too, like kind of like a rounder, kind of wider face. Oh shit, that's actually a. Oh, I kind of do look like that motherfucker, <laughs> just with longer hair. What the fuck? Ooh, one shot of that guy. <laughs> that's a pretty, that's a pretty accurate description, like Post Malone combined with Jesus. You know, I've even had some people say Kurt Cobain, like. I guess that maybe 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 when my hair is a little bit shorter, yeah. That's funny. Like if I just cut my hair down, I look like Post Malone for real. That's funny. Oh, oh! How'd that not kill him? What? This is this is ridiculous. Okay, that that had to get him. Got him. Oof! Headshot. Oh, is this the tank Gouver? Let's go, baby. I need to add the ammunition for this thing. I don't have it. 13 millimeter, bro. That's humongous. <laughs> there you heal up. Is there. I guess I killed everybody. Okay. Nice. Easy money, baby. Into the vault, then. No, you're not crazy. There are two different riot shields that I put in the... That I put in the uh, randomizer. That was the run. Going all right. Uh, we finally made it to the vault. I'll go back to arc check later. Oh, ow. Could you imagine getting shot, like, right, like, right under your armpit with a 13mm anti-tank rifle? Ouchie. That would, I mean, in real life, that would have ripped a hole straight through this guy. He would have died instantly. Would have destroyed his upper chest cavity. There would have been nothing left. Oh, great, I got this piece of shit. Woo. I wonder if I should just take all the vanilla weapons out. Maybe I will if I add more weapons to the randomizer. They didn't notice. That still didn't one shot him? There we go. Oh. Is this one bugged? Yeah, this one's bugged. I need to fix this. It's an invisible USB 45. It's just like an upgraded finger gun, basically, you know? That's what I would say. Wish Fola had this many guns? Absolutely. But, you know, Bethesda's really lazy, so they had, like, no guns in Fallout 4. They had way less fo guns than... You're the damn acid suck, are you kidding me? That's what I'm saying. Fallout 4 is just a huge downgrade in so many ways. Like, less guns, less ammunition, less role-playing, less dialogue options, less skills, perks. Or m more perks, but no skills, you know? Which is funny. Like, everyone always says, oh, Fallout 4 is a great shooter game. It's way better than Fallout New Vegas and Fallout 3. It's a, it, it's a much better shooter game. Like, no, it's not. No. It's worse. Well, just because it's... You can aim down sights and you can sprint around? Is that why it's better? Because the animations are better? I mean, that, that's debatable, actually. The animations are pretty bad. I'm probably going to die here with this damn thing. I can't even hit... I'm just gonna have to... Dude. <laughs> Do I... Is my plate even on right now? I swear, it must be broken at this point. I just don't see how I'm gonna get a kill with this thing. I really don't. Look, they're gonna mow my ass down as soon as I run in there. 
Yeah, I'm, th this is a guaranteed death. I'm already dead. I have one HP. Look at that. This the this thing is a humongous piece of shit. Yep. I mean, I might as well just take the L and just just roll the dice again. When you get weapons like that, you have to like. Basically, you have to maybe kill like a bug or something or like a ghoul. It's kind of hard running into a freaking whole squad of people shooting at you. That's not very smart, obviously. Hello. <laughs> Let me go and make sure I put that in the death counter. Um, <laughs> freaking anti-tank rifle straight to the dome, bro. Poor guy. Oh! Ow! At 45 ACP. Tell you what. You can take down a cow. One bullet. Why the hell would anyone go to Hit the mouse. Nice. Oh! I got the... Dude, I got the diamond sword. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Do you like my sword, 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 my diamond sword, sword? <laughs> I was waiting for this one, man. Dude, I was surprised it took so long to get this one. It was very elusive. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna heal up, put on my plate, and I'm gonna run in there and go stab one of these dudes with a diamond sword. Uh oh. Oh, this is gonna be easy kill. Ooh, look at that was a lot of damage. I mean it's a diamond sword. This is actually balanced because the diamond sword is actually really good in Minecraft, so I mean two shot kills. Totally fair. Diamond sword's OP. Please nerf. I need to add the netherite sword after this one, you know. After this one. I hate- Who puts a scope on a fucking pistol? This is so stupid. There was no zoom on it anyway! What's the point of having a, a scope if there's no zoom? That was so silly. I can't see jack shit with these irons. Oh yes, the XM5, the most advanced rifle in the entire world, and it has dog shit iron sights. That's hilarious. I, I'm just shooting. I can't see anything. Those little peep sights. I just hate those type those types of irons. Why do they exist? They're terrible. Oh, that just auto-equipped. Yeah, since the Glock is replacing the 10 millimeter, um, there's like a, there's like this little script with the mod to where like if you pick up a vanilla weapon, it automatically equips it. So, uh, obviously we're not going to do it that way. But sweet. I made it past that section. That's good. Ooh. Making progress. Did I already quick save? I think I already did quick save. You know what? You can never quick save enough in this game. Dude, I've gotten the Karambit a lot. It's kind of weird how, like, the, the natural distribution works in a randomizer. It's like... You can get the same thing ten times in a row, but then you'll get this one gun, like, only once throughout your entire playthrough. It's just weird how that works. To be like that. I already did heal, right? Whatever. Let's go stab. Oh, I have to go stab this guy. That's funny. You won't even see it coming. He'll be an easy kill. Keep talking, meathead. Ooh. Yeah, he cut his head off. Nice. Twisty man, twisty. Oh yeah, that was over right there. Oh, I just, I totally forgot from earlier. Um, it didn't show up in the overlay, but uh, some guy joined the, uh, joined the members. I see it now. Bullseye Ben, welcome to the Epic Gamers, man. Thanks for joining. Thank you very much. I don't know how to fix that, honestly. How do I, how do I fix my overlay being so delayed and not working sometimes? It'd be like that. Um, all right, we got Nick now. That's cool. When Niv, why does he come all this way? Risk life and limb. An old private eye. Is there a railgun? No, no railgun. I do have the prototype Gauss rifle. It's a coil gun. Very similar. Like I have the vanilla Gauss. No, I actually I don't have the vanilla Gauss rifle in here. I have the prototype Gauss rifle. I also have the Gauss revolver. So yeah, there's two there's two gauss weapons, two coil guns. So that's cool. Blah blah blah. I don't know. It seemed like you needed help. <laughs> I don't think I've have I gotten the gauss revolver yet. I think I got it one time maybe. It's 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 definitely in there though. 
Anyway, you got trouble, uh, and I'm glad to help. My bike now be too loud. Time, I feel like I've been talking really loud. Hello, hello. No, it's in the yellow. Okay, that's fine. Shave beard stream? No. <laughs> No, get out of here. I will never, bro. I'll, I'll look like I'm 12 years old if I, if I, if I shave. I'm never doing that again. I have not shaved in five years. Not actually. I do trim, obviously. Alright, let's go smoke these dudes. Oh. Seriously? Oh, Thunderstick. Oh, oh, ooh. Quick scope. <laughs> dude, I love that gun. The GM6 Lynx is so based. This dude is, has a Ranger Sequoia? What? I didn't know they could spawn with unique weapons. That's crazy. Interesting. Hurry up, Nick. Oh! <laughs> Sorry. Anyway. Oh, sweet. Another, do another donation, though. Let's go. From Hiko Mori Gaming, the two dollars. Thank you very much. Really appreciate that. Hiko Mori said, "No, Hikiko, Hikiko Mori." It said, "I have over three hundred plus mods and still finding more." Awesome. That's what I'm saying, man. You can never have enough mods. Three hundred. Those are rookie numbers, man. You need to pump those numbers up. And you get four hundred, five hundred, six hundred. When you can get to seven hundred mods, then you can talk to me because I'm at like six hundred something right now. Around like 650, something like that. Now it shows it. Damn, that stuff's really delayed. Like I had delayed like a whole last minute. I missed. Let me just. <laughs> Bro got domed. Just tanked that shot. Nick, where's your gun at? Why are you still using a pipe revolver? That's goofy. Easy. Oh, Storm Gewehr. Let's go, baby. This one's dope. Oh! Decap- Oh! Oh no! This might kill me, actually! <laughs> the, the Merv indoors? Might just- Okay, let's just bash him with it. <laughs> that was so stupid! I just bashed him with a nuke launcher. Ooh. Striker. Ooh! That was a sweet combo right there. Smoked him. 45 ACP. Damn, actually, that was. He tanked all those shots. Sometimes they be like that. Look, the. Motherfucker. Uh, I don't know. Like, it's. What were, what were the numbers saying? Like, 1820? Should be doing like 35. He's not even wearing any armor, so. I don't know. Still killed him, though. Where are we going? This mod looks fun as ASL. You mean as fuck? ASF, you mean? Oh, yeah. In that case, then yes, it is a very cool mod. I'm having lots of fun. I'm surprised my game has not crashed today so far. It crashed a bunch yesterday. But it seems we've got to, we've got to sort it sorted out mostly. Mostly. We'll see. Especially being in downtown area. Um, it might crash again, but we'll see. How many guns can these guys spawn with? Um, I don't know. Almost anything, really. I there's this. I'm pretty sure it's this one mod called uh, Unleveled World. I'm pretty sure it's that one that makes it to where like any NPC can spawn with any weapon that you have in your that, that you have in your game. So these guys are spawning with all kinds of weapons, which is awesome because there's so much variety. You know, instead of them just spawning with the same exact gun over and over again, it's pretty dope. I also replaced all the vanilla guns, so. You're not going to be seeing the sub, the regular submachine gun or the uh, or the 10 millimeter. The submachine gun got replaced by the MP5, and the 10 millimeter got replaced by the Glock. You know. Oh yeah, and I got the. This is the real Tommy gun right here. This one is so much better than the the stupid toy submachine gun they got in Fallout 4. Anyway, let's go. Uh, let's just go and beat all these people up. Up. Oh, I think my game's crashing. Well, we should, uh, speak of the devil. I literally said. I literally said, yeah, my game hasn't crashed yet. We're good. <laughs> and it crashes when I shoot at Skinny Malone for some reason? That's really weird. Uh, first crash of the day. 
That was really odd. I don't even know what my crash log didn't even show up. I don't know what caused that. It's literally, it's literally just running on like some kind of logic to where it only crashes whenever I say it's not going to crash. That's just how it works. You know? Literally jinxed it, yeah. <laughs> Would you replace the pipe guns with? With other pipe guns. With better pipe guns. I replaced the, the revolver with a handmade revolver. It's the... The one from the bundle of tape mod. I replaced the the regular pipe gun. The submachine gun version. With like a homemade... Uh, it, it's, it's based off the Tech 9. It's like a homemade Tech 9. And the... Uh, what did I replace the sniper variant with? I think I replaced the sniper with the uh, handmade anti-material rifle, right? Or no. Maybe it was something else. I forgot. Would you replace the assault rifle with? The Mark 18. I might change it to be the M16. Or some kind of other service rifle mod like that. Because I think I think like an like an M sixteen A two fits better into the Fallout universe than just a Mark eighteen. You know, I think we can all agree on that. But I just put the Mark eighteen for now because the animations are really good. You know, like what do y'all think? What do y'all think? Th th this is an interesting question. What do you guys think um, should be the standard Fallout assault rifle? Right. For me, I would say like some kind of M sixteen. Preferably like an M16A2, you know. I would say that fits better into like the Fallout, the Fallout vibe. Maybe an A1 as well. You're like from New Vegas, the service rifle from that game is based on the A1. So I shoot this guy. Service rifle, the wood finish. Yeah, there you go. This guy says G3. I mean, yeah, you guys can't go wrong with G3 and M16. I would say that well, like technically the G3 is a battle rifle, but I think you could have both of them in the game. You know. M16A2. There you go. G36? Ooh, okay. That's a hot take. I haven't seen that one in there. I mean, the G36 would definitely fit into Fallout. Literally, pretty much any HK gun just has, like, this weird, like, retro space age vibe to it. Like, retro... Like, just HK guns in general already have, like, a retro futuristic look to them. You know? They're, like, way ahead of their time. See? I didn't crash this time. Is this Darla? Get no scope. One more guy. Oh, I got the I got the rainbow gun. A lot of recoil on that thing. <laughs> shooting, shooting rainbows at that guy. I almost died, but we made it. Let's go, baby. <laughs> That's funny. While you're coming there, the M14 maybe? No, the. I mean, I could see like. Some kind of M14 pattern rifle still being used. I'm not sure about the Mark 14, like the Mark 14 EBR, though. It's a little bit too tactical looking. What's your FOV? Mine's at, I think, 99. Do I remember correctly? Ninety nine. Ninety nine. There you go, baby. Not 100, because 99 is way cooler, obviously. What is this? Is this the is this the rifle? I think, it's, or is it a shotgun? Okay, it's the shotgun. Okay. Nice. Oh, a pacifier perk might be useful. Do I still have that in the game? Well, I actually, I don't. I can't use the pacifier perk because I have one charisma, so that's out of the question. <laughs> you know, I'm just gonna have to just tank on through it. Add in an AC-130. I don't have an AC-130, but I do have a uh, A10, A10 Warthog in the game. <laughs> I should do an entire, dude. I should add that to the randomizer. That would be hilarious. Like, um. Maybe I'll do that for like a part two. I'll add in some more crazy weapons. Like, I guess, I don't know if you call that a weapon, but I, I could put that in the, re in the randomizer where it gives you like the little goggles to call in the A-10 Warthog, bro. I need to add that. Oh, that would be so cool. Good idea. Bro, okay. If you guys have any suggestions, 
uh, for like any wacky weapons or just really good weapons or cool weapons that you like, um, let me know. Like, like, comment in the comment section. Let me know what what weapons you would like to see in this randomizer run, because I want to keep on adding more. For right now, for this first part, I added in you know a hundred, hundred and seventy, eighty, I think. Um, I've already got the SGG forty four. Just so you know, I think you missed that part earlier. I've already got the Spaz 12. The G11, there you go. I need to add the G11. Uh, of course, there are going to be a lot of these guns that y'all are going to say. Uh, chances are, I might already have it added. I already got the MG42. But, uh, try and think of some, like, wacky stuff. Like, this dude said a musket. I don't think there are any good musket mods, though. Um, I already, ha I already have the Cazador. I've already got the, I've already got the Tank Guevara. I do not have the Lee Enfield, though. I've already got a bunch of other bolt-action rifles, so, like, I want to try... I've already got the crossbow, you know. The M91. I don't have that one added right now, actually. Okay, I'll definitely write that... Okay. D the G11's definitely going to go in there. The Bryn, maybe. I d there is a Bryn mod that I, I don't have it added. So I'll, I'll, I'll have to put those down. The Pancor Jackhammer? Oh, no. <laughs> is that a mod? Is there a mod for that? EM2? EM2 rifle, I don't have that one in there. Okay. Melee weapons, yeah. Yeah, melee weapons too. Like, melee weapons, as long as... It, it, but try to make it a cool one. Don't make it too too basic, you know? Yeah, I got the SVD. Got the AS Val. A Calibri? I don't think there's a mod for that. AK-5. I've already got the AK-5. A BB gun? Okay, RPD. I've already got the RPD. I've got the trench shotgun. The Doom Sword. The Doom Sword, maybe. A lightsaber? Okay. I'll try and get those. I should also add, like, the Doom Super Shotgun. That'd be funny. Lewis Gun. I do have the Lewis Gun in here, I think. I, we haven't gotten it yet. It should be in the randomizer, though. It should be in the randomizer. Handheld Dushka? <laughs> I don't think there's a mod for that one. That'd be awesome, though. Luger. I do have... I have a handmade Luger, but not the actual Luger. Some good suggestions, though. Really appreciate it. Let me smoke this guy. Oof. That was a headshot. Yeah, I blew his head off, see? I blew his head off so good that, uh... His mask is still on, but he's dead. <laughs> that's funny. KS-23, that's a good one. PTRS-41, okay. Good suggestions. I've already got the finger gun, actually. I've got the finger gun. The Henry Martini, that's a good one. I do have that mod, but it's not in the randomizer yet. A lot of good suggestions, guys. Really appreciate it. Lightsaber, someone already said that. An 88mm flat cannon? <laughs> I, I need to add that one. I, there is a mod for that, actually. There is a mod for some kind of flat cannon. Not an 88mm one, though. That's huge. That's, like... I don't think you could carry a gun that big. Even with power armor. I don't know, man. I do have the Street Super. Um, the Tab 95. I don't have that one in there, now. Panzer Shrek. I don't think there is a good Panzer Shrek mod, actually. I do have the flamethrower, though. I got the M2 flamethrower specifically. Ooh, the quad shotgun. That's a good one. A pickaxe. I do have a pickaxe, actually. Oh, the BFG? That's a good one. That's a good one. The Shiogren? Is that how you say it? Shiogren? In that silly little shotgun? That's a good one. I'll have to add that one as well. Well, at some point, though, I will run out of... I will run out of uh, space, though. So I can only add so many at one time. You know, I could always take some weapons out. Take out some basic weapons. Like, maybe I'll take out the FAMAS or something. But the FAMAS is a really nice gun, though. Because I want to try and make things a little bit more wacky. A little bit more obscure. Just to make it more interesting. Look how I ran away back to Diamond City when it's completely unnecessary. I, I was supposed to talk to Nick that whole time. I'm stupid. I was too busy reading comments. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> I was supposed to talk to him. Okay, now I do have to fast travel. A blow dart? I don't think there's any blow darts. I do have a shuriken, actually. There is a shuriken in the randomizer. I Have I gotten it yet? I may have gotten it like one time. The Maxim? I don't think there is a good Maxim mod at all. See, there are a lot of there are a lot of gun mods for Fallout 4, but there are quite a few that uh, sadly are not in the game yet. Like just recently, 
just the other day, for the first time ever, we got a DP-28. I was like, dude, that took forever. Where is this guy? Arasaka. I don't think there's a mod for that one. Maybe. Yeah, I ran by Nick again. Yeah, I'm just... I'm too busy reading comments. This is, what, this is exactly why you don't text and drive, guys. You know? <laughs> this is exactly why you don't text and drive. You're all so distracted. You're reading comments. Ran straight past this guy. Thunder gun. Is there a mod for that? I don't think there is a mod for that. Uh, uh, I'll meet you there. Wonderwolf? That'd be dope. Long work for two level up. Let's go, baby. Oh, I leveled up that many times? God dang. Action boys OP. Please nerf. Not really, though. Quick hands. Can't go wrong. Well, you don't even need strong back that much. Oh my goodness. Holy moly. Hmm. So what are all the melee perks? Swinger, like... That could be useful. What, unarmed. Can disarm foes. Ooh. Interesting. I don't think I really have any unarmed weapons in this randomizer, though. I don't have the power fist or anything. There's no death clog gauntlet in the randomizer. Because I know those are considered as, like, unarmed weapons. Um, just trying to find any, like, melee weapons. Like, something like this would be really useful, but I have to get to melee to 100 first to get that to work. If I increase my survival, I could take some more... Uh, more perks like Animantium Skeleton. That one's good. Maybe we can just level up faster. Like, the bloody mess in my game makes it to where you just level up faster. We can just do that. Really don't need strong back that much. Mar uh, <laughs> I can only carry one weapon at a time, really. Like I said, I'll just level up faster. Screw it. And, uh... I really don't need to level up anything. I don't need to level up barter, engineering. I'm not going to be upgrading anything. Just level up medicine, I guess. You know? Make my stim packs more effective. Why not? Level up melee. Sure. 69. Nice. Got another donation there. My boy Neo. He said, just add spells and shouts from Skyrim. Brandy, I know you want to. I know the voices in your head are telling you to do so. Don't deny it. <laughs> See, I do remember there being some kind of mod that adds in, like, um... That adds in magic, which is kind of like, um, stuff from Skyrim. So... I'll definitely have to add in some... No, I remember, like, there's this one mod. It adds in, like, little wands. And, like, you, like, you shoot out... So it's, It sort of functions like a grenade launcher, almost. You shoot little balls of, like, energy and it blows up. I'll have to add in that one. That's a good one. As well as the A-10 Warthog. <laughs> Dude, I would, I can already see, like, part two being crazy, man. What I'll do, probably, is just, like... I'll probably stop the video, like... Or stop, stop streaming the playthrough, like, halfway into the main quest and make a video out of it. And part two will add even more wackier weapons. So that'd be dope. Okay, now we can go back to Diamond City. Right? Where's the... I'm so confused. Where's Nick even going? He's going the wrong way. Bro. At least there's no answer to this picnic. I can activate all these? What the hell? Where's the mission to go meet to go meet Valentine back at, the Di at Diamond City? I'm so confused. Uh, I don't know. I'll just travel there anyway. Sheesh. What's the goofiest weapon mod in this run? Um, probably the nerf gun. The finger gun's also pretty funny. The nerf gun and the finger gun are definitely up there for the, for the, for the goofiest. There's also the riot shield too, which is pretty funny. Um, what's another one? What's another silly one? I can't remember. There's not too many silly ones. There's also stuff like the paddle ball and the acid soaker, which are vanilla. Still got those in there because they're really stupid. 
can't really think of anything else that's too crazy. Oh yeah, the throwing shoe. The throwing shoe. That's a funny one. <laughs> I still have that in my inventory. That's funny. Yeah, the throwing shoe is probably takes the number one spot, actually. <laughs> it's it's because it's even worse than the finger gun. Because you have to throw it and then pick it back up. This is definitely probably the worst in the Actually, the pie is even worse though. No, the pie is worse. Because the throwing pie, you can't reuse it. So you're just screwed. You know? So yeah, the throwing shoe and the throwing pie are, are probably the goofiest. Alongside the finger gun and the nerf gun. Bro has nothing I can use. Wow. Um, maybe I'll just buy some screws. Mm -hmm. Bro don't got nothing. Cancel that. I'm just cancel that and go. I'll go trade it to this other girl over in Diamond City. Star Wars blaster. Oh yeah, that'd be a good one. These are, aren't really any Star Wars gun mods for Fallout 4 though. But there's a lightsaber mod though. Oh yeah, the rainbow gun. The uh, the the FAL that shoots rainbows. That's a pretty silly one as well. That was hilarious. I want, I want to get that one more. It's really overpowered, too. I should probably nerf it, honestly. Like, two shots, everything. Uh, yeah, I need the shimmer to fiberglass. Oh, my goodness. It's a good thing I can just pick up all these guns and sell them. That's cool. Damn. <laughs> Don't need all that. Oh, I want to keep that, actually. No. Why not? That's a really expensive shipment of fiberglass, I'll tell you what. Not a lot of cell ammunition, though, obviously. It's part of the... part of the mod. That's fine, I'll accept that trade. I'm gonna replace my plate. Bolter? Are there any Bolter mods? Ray gun. Make sure to write all these down, obviously. I'll come back later at the end of the stream. I'll go back to this section of the video and, like, look at all the comments and write all these down. I'll try and add them for next time. But for now, you know, before before I continue with the uh, the main quest, let's go back to Arcjet and get some revenge. You know? I'm gonna kill these losers. These damn synths. Rolling pin? That's vanilla. I don't want to have too many vanilla weapons. I took out most of them. I did keep a few in. But for the most part, I'm trying to remove vanilla weapons, not add in more. What are these muties up to? This scope does not go very far. 22 damage? Damn. Seems kind of bugged. Should be doing a lot more. Okay, they do have big metal arm rods. That makes more sense. I missed that. I'm not very good. I'm... Oh. It's the beep of death. Why are they not using guns? They're just running at me. Why is he... I just realized he's manually taking the clip out of the gun. It's weird. Okay. Well, I do not want to melee this guy. <laughs> this guy's almost dead. I feel like these guys are bugged out. They're not using their guns. They don't. He only spawned with a flashbang. Oh, great. Now he gave me a tomahawk. Maybe I can hit him with the. Hit the tomahawk on his mini nuke and kill him. I missed entirely. Okay. Now I gotta punch people to death. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? <laughs> I'm edging this super mutant suicider. Oh, like, I'll lead him right to this group of people. Who are these people? Are these raiders? Oh, God. Ow. Here, run into these guys. Don't shoot me. No, they killed him. Oh, dude. He was he was this close, too. That's so unfortunate. God dang it, Bobby. All right. Well, that's another death. God dang it, Bobby. Oh, I spawned way back here. That sucks. 
Oh yeah, because the fast travel auto save. That's why. Ugh. Hello, Brandy. Hello, citizen. What the hell? It's like a random event. Something. You know, what? I'll just worry about those guys later. I want to kill these sins. I think of my revenge, you know. The Simpsons gun is another funny mod. Okay. Is that the Magfed revolver? Oh, because the dripping cock from earlier. <laughs> oh no, it's still a, it's dead. Okay, that's weird. Anyway, let's continue. I like how Paladin and Dance was just sitting there the whole time. Bruh. <laughs> He's been fighting these since for years. He shouldn't be dying. See, look. See, look. You look at my health bar. He did an appropriate amount of damage. He took only like 10% of my health. Okay. I did get shot a few times there. This is actually balanced now. Okay, I still died. Wow. They can still shred you though. But at least it's balanced. <laughs> I'll get it this time, guys. Don't worry. I'll get it this time. Oh, sweet. Got a donation there. Let's see. That was from Dex. My boy Dex with the five R dollars. Not sure what that is, but uh, thank you very much for the five R dollars. Appreciate it very much. You said the arc jet gas leak trap went off because you were set on fire by the sense laser guns. Okay. I don't know. Was, a la was it a laser gun only kind of thing? Huh. I thought you could just ignite the gas with regular bullets, which obviously doesn't make sense, but like I, in Fallout 4, I thought, it, I thought it worked that way. Interesting. Thank you for letting me know. It makes a lot more sense that only laser guns can do it. Where are you guys at? Oh, there he is. Winchester? Okay. Wait. Oh, wait. I see it now. I was like, how am I using a scope on this thing? There's no scope, but it's, it's, it's mounted on the side. I got shot in the back, didn't I? Okay. Uh, it's, it's definitely doable, though. It's definitely doable. Because these guys, um, the time to kill is a lot relatively slower than it was before, at least. There's just so many of them. And Paladin and Dance isn't doing jack shit. He's in freaking full power armor and he's still just kneeling down. Like, bro, do something. What a loser. What is this, Benelli? Ouch. And then I'm over here to one-shot these guys. So if I run in here, and then sneak around... See, it was this guy that killed me last time. There we go. Ow. Okay. I'll fill up. Peek around the corner. What the fuck? That is not what I wanted to do. Hello? Okay, jeez. Dude was just tanking those shots. There we go. I think I killed all of them, too. I gained the Lord Death perk. Would you look at that? That's cool. Okay, I finally killed all those bastards. I got some... Oh, wait, there's still one more. What the? What the? What? Why is his head just floating there? Oh, I got the nerf gun. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. Well, uh... I did make it through that section, though, so that's good. That is definitely good news. Well, I'm at it. What should I take here? <laughs> I don't even know, man. I can't think. Of, I'll save it for later then. Yeah, I'll go and quick save here. I had auto saved anyway. Sheesh. Yeah, this thing's doing regular damage now. It's balanced. As you guys saw, they can still shred through me if I just stand there and eat it like a like a buffoon. Still deadly, but uh, not a one shot kill anymore, which is fantastic. I fixed it. Nerf looks OP. Oh yeah, this OP. Oh, it's semi-auto, too. That's great. I hope I can kill this. No. This damage is so low that it's not even showing up on the floating damage mod. That's how low it is, actually. I just have to bash him. I'm gonna die. Ow. My armor plate is broken as well, so that's cool. Zero damage. Literally zero damage. It's because the um all the robots have high damage resistance. And so if you're only doing... 
if you're doing like two damage, physical damage, it like the armor cancels it out completely because the, their damage resistance is too high. Unfortunately, nerf darts cannot penetrate metal. Very unrealistic, I know. It's uh, it's not doing any damage at all. I did that did seven damage though. That did like five damage. Oh, let's go! <laughs> that was perfect. Thank you, Dance. I really appreciate that. A Sergeant Ash. What is that? Wait, what? Am I supposed to be using the zap gun? I saw Sergeant Ash in the top left corner. I don't remember picking up. Hold up. I'm going to go back. Guys, did it switch to the zap gun? I'm so confused. It definitely wasn't the AER, though. Let me, let, me, let me look. Yeah, it says Sergeant Ash. What the fuck is that? It's like a legendary weapon. Oh. Oh, okay. It's like a... That's weird. A flamethrower? Is this a flamethrower? The shotgun laser. Okay, that's really odd. This is obviously, um, I think I used this gun to replace one of the vanilla weapons or something. It's bugged. It's, it's named as a vanilla weapon, but it's actually a laser gun, a modded, yeah, that's really odd. I don't know why that's the case. Obviously, I did not use the laser gun to replace the vanilla flamethrower. I used the M2 flamethrower to, to replace the vanilla flamethrower, so I... Don't know why this is showing up as a vanilla flamethrower, or why it's named as that. That's weird. But this is the weapon we're supposed to use, so, okay. Fine by me. Really weird, though. <laughs> Engine course ahead. Woo. Be our final stop. It identifies as a flamethrower. <laughs> this guy, bro. Like Thought that was a turret. I can't see. Oh, yeah, 16 times the detail. God rays. Where, where, where are those God rays even coming from, huh? Nowhere. Look at that. Alright, you know how we do it. Nope. Just keep, keep on clicking. Look at it eventually. I really don't feel like doing this stupid minigame. I probably should just get the easy hacking mod, honestly, because I hate hacking in Fallout. It's so lame. I'll get it eventually, I swear. Maybe I should actually do it at this point. Okay. Easy. Likeness is zero. E. A. S. Y. None of these match. Likeness is zero. E. A. S. No, it's not that one. F. E. A. T. It could be such. There we go. I'm genius. I'm an expert hacker, I tell you what. Engine core power restored. E. Sports. It's in the game. The sound is really low. I did turn it down quite a bit. You guys want me to turn up the in-game volume? I turned it down quite a bit to make sure that my volume, like me talking, was uh, loud enough. Yeah. I turned up two notches. Let me know. How, let me know what you guys think about the the in-game volume. Oh, my voice is low. But my, my voice is like, it's in the yellow. So I mean. I don't know, man. Maybe to turn up your actual PC volume, <laughs> you know? <laughs> you try that. Commencing five second countdown. Five. I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think of the audio? This should be good. This should be a good mix right here. Well, I can see. I can see on my OBS right there. Like my audio is like my mic audio is consistently in the yellow, which means like you're good. If anything, that means it's slightly too loud. Yeah. I don't know. This guy over here is tripping, bro. He's tripping. Hurry up. The yeah, audio's good? Okay, cool. That's what I was saying. Like, before I started this stream, I made sure the audio was fine. Because oh, I remember, like, last stream for the Glowing Sea playthrough, I was... Um, every single time I tried to edit my audio, the settings would reset to, like, max volume each time. And I forgot to change it. But then I realized I, it, the reason why it, my settings were resetting is because my any settings were set to read only. And if you set your any settings any settings to read only, 
then you can't actually change them in-game. You know, so you have to change them, you have to take off the read-only flag for you to be able to edit the settings. It took me forever to figure that out, but I figured it out finally. Genius. Try to slow on the screen. Yeah, in general, my overlay is a little bit delayed. I'm not sure how to fix that, honestly. It still works, though. Mostly. <laughs> it's just, yeah, it's delayed by like a whole like minute, honestly. It's kind of, kind of cringe. Oh, don't want to do that. Okay, let's get out of here. It's weird. Uh, it's around 15 to 20 se 25 seconds. Okay, that's not too bad. Could be worse. Oh. I just killed Peladin Dance. I just I just crushed it with an elevator. It went <laughs> Oh there he is, he spawned back. Oh yeah, I forgot about this part. Oh nice, I missed. Oh, this gun is so good. I think so. Yeah, Paladin, you, you take care of it. I don't want to do this. See now he can actually Okay, he, he can't take that much, sadly. But he can take a little bit more than last time, at least. Dude, this thing's a huge piece of shit. Look how much damage is... I probably need to buff this thing. Look at this. Even with a critical hit, it did no damage. Okay. I'm gonna go back down the elevator. Right, I'm gonna trap this guy in here. Not kill him. Well, he's 1 HP. Let's go. I got a knife. Don't worry. I'll just knife this... What kind of animation is that? Pipe gun, let's go, baby. Woo. Full auto with a freaking sniper scope. That's hilarious. Well, I got three shitty weapons right there in a row, but... Oh. Just wall hack that guy. Oh, sweet. I got the Gauss revolver. Let's go. Let's go. Whew. Okay. Made it out of there alive. Arc, arc Jet Redemption Arc is replete. It's, it's complete. I don't know why saying Arc Jet is really hard to say. It's like a tongue twister. Arc Jet. Arc Jet Redemption Arc. Say that ten times fast. Yes, it's a Gauss Revolver. I know that sounds weird. But look. Like you can see. The cylinder rotates right there. It's pretty, pretty neat. It's a pretty cool gun design. You don't see too many good, like, fantasy, um... What do you call them? Fantasy, like, weapon designs for Fallout 4 mods that are really well made. But this is, this is a really good one. I will say, though, it's like... I don't know how Gauss weapons work, but it's kind of weird how, like, the rounds are, like, exposed in the back. I don't know. I don't even want to begin to comprehend it. Oh! <laughs> he just bursted into flames. Whoa! What was that? Can you pack a punch it? No. There's no pack a punch in this game, sadly. I wish there was. It needs to be a mod for real. Well, that could have gone smoother, but mission accomplished. Yes. Agreed. It's a refreshing change. Agreed. That being said, I believe we have two important matters to Yeah, you can charge it too. It, it works just like the vanilla Gauss rifle. You can charge up your shots, which is cool. Damage is kind of scary. Yeah, it's a freaking Gauss gun. <laughs> Shooting some at the speed of light, bro. Shred through anything, for real. Hmm. Oh, thank you. What's your favorite gun in Starfield? <laughs> None of them. <laughs> I mean, I would just say the 1911. That's the only... It's actually really good to use in game, too. Like, the 1911 is surprisingly OP. Um, really fun to use. Oh, although I will say, there's that one... What do you call it? The... It's literally a Gauss revolver. Right? It's a... It's one of the, it's one of the mag guns. Because the mag guns are like electromagnetic weapons. Are those the same thing? Electromagnetic coil gun Gauss? Are the, is that all the same thing? I think. But there's like a... There's an electromagnetic revolver in that game. It's like really square shaped. I forgot what it was called. It was mag something. 
the mag something. That thing is stupid OP. It is actually the best gun in the game, especially if you get the key hauler one. You, if you get that one from the the quest line with the space raiders, I forgot their name already. Oh, the Crimson Fleet. Yeah, that thing is busted. It's a fully automatic electromagnetic, electromagnetic revolver. And it just, <laughs> just shreds straight through people. I'm like, damn, dude. Their balancing is absolutely dog shit in that game. It's hilarious. I just used that thing for the rest of the game. It was too good. You know? Uh, yeah, I'd be, I'd be honest. Sure. That's what I wanted to hear. Meet me back at the police station, and we'll discuss the details. It looks like TKS Mantis. What the hell? I don't even know what that guy looks like. Does he look like me? I have no clue. Never saw your face before. 10 out of 10 face reveal. Thank you. Really appreciate all the comments, guys. Call me pretty and shit. I like that. Well, at least I'm not ugly. <laughs> oh, who's this guy? This is the guy that was under the ground earlier. I found it first. Could try to blow it open. What? Is this one of those random events? It's talking about like a safe he's gonna blow open. Where's that at? There's a purple Meyer lurk up here. Okay. A sea lurk, actually, that's what it's called. Did you see the interview with the creator of Fallout? No. When did that come out? Interview from Hugh. From who? I don't know what you're on about, bro. What are you on about, bro? Before I do that, I actually want to go kill Kellogg. I want to do that next. Maybe I should. 734. Let's see. Where is the mission to continue the main quest? Whatever, I'll just go to Valentine's. Valentine's place. Quincy next. Whew, I don't know about that one. Can I see the animations of the GM6? Yeah, sure. These are really good. Dude. <laughs> Dude, it's so good. If, if you'll, um... There was this meme that came out that the Modern Warfare GM6, the beat of the way it shoots syncs perfectly with uh, the, the milkshake song. My milkshake brings other boys to the yard and they're like, it's better than yours. You know, it's, you know that song? Literally, try, try and look up that meme. It's, it's hilarious. Just, just listen to that. Just listen to this, guys. Just listen to it. Mm. Yeah, yeah, this is the animation from Modern Warfare 2, yeah. It, it's literally ported straight from the game. Which is pretty dope. It's literally called the Signal 50. It's based on the GM6 Lynx. It's not a 100% replica, obviously. But I just call it the Lynx for simplicity's sake. Because I'm not going to call this gun the Signal 50. That sounds stupid. You know. But it's, it's a really cool gun. Absolutely beautiful. Very cool. I, I just had to add it. You know. I tried to... Like, I already have a bunch of, like, tactical modern gun mods in my game. I tried to... Add in, not add in so many of them, but so many of them were just so satisfying to use that I couldn't help but add this one in there. I just had to, bro. It was mandatory. It's so satisfying. Like, that's one thing I can say about Call of Duty, man. Their guns have great animations and great sounds. Although they do just keep puking out the same shit every year. At least, at least they, it's shit with good animations, you know? <laughs> okay, now the quest started. Okay. Yeah, it still works. I was I was worried that the main quest was bugged for a second. Well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You save Nick, this agency, and the modern games you'll fit in Fallout. Depends what you mean by modern exactly. If you mean like the XM5, no, not really. If you're talking about the M16, which is also still considered a modern weapon, then yes, obviously. Like, there's a, there is a distinction you have to make. I literally made a whole video on that topic, which is funny. Basically, the, the thing is, like, modern guns from, like, the 90s up to the 90s is yes. But any modern gun after, like, the 2000s is kind of like a mm, not really, you know. It's like, you can still you can still fit some in there. Because, like, you know, like, the, the M4 from New Vegas is a good example. It has, like, the, the hybrid red dot on top. But anything from, like, 2010 plus is, like, it, it's doesn't belong in Fallout, I would say. 
But I still put those guns mods in the game anyway because they're really fun to use and they have great animations. I literally have to make another like a follow up oh, to that video. That was surprised how how like people love talking about this topic. No. It's crazy. Whoa. One case at a time. All right, let's get down to business. Yeah, this guy said World War II to Cold War era. That's fair. Yeah, I would say like. The guns in Fallout should be late Cold War era, like up to like the 80s, 90s. Maybe a little bit of like late 90s, early 2000s, maybe a little bit of that. But not too much, obviously. I think they should stick to late Cold War era type firearms. Stuff like that. But also they should have like the futuristic stuff, like the 10mm. And uh... There's not too many futuristic guns in Fallout. <laughs> There's the 10mm pistol. There's the 10mm SMG. What are some other futuristic guns? I don't know. They li it's so funny about the Fallout universe. They just they just stopped making guns. They're like, let's just use the fucking G3 for fit for 100 years straight. <laughs> I'm like, what? <laughs> like, okay. I guess that's fair. Oh, the 12 the 12 the 12 meter the 12 millimeter SMG. But that one's a really goofy design though, so. The plasma guns. Uh, yeah. I'm talking about like ballistic firearms, you know. Oh, sweet, Zach. Thanks for for becoming a member. Really appreciate that. Let's go, baby. I'm talking about when it comes to ballistic firearms, guys. There's no futuristic ballistic firearms, really. There's very few. You know? And here's the thing, right? Energy weapons, like plasma guns and energy weapons, were not made until the 2060s. 2060 is when, fusion, is when the fusion cell got created. Somewhere around there. So it's like... They literally did not create any new firearms in between then, basically. For like 60 years straight. They created no new firearms. Like that's kind of bullshit. Like besides the 10 millimeter. That's it. You think they would have created more than just that? Like, come on now. There's the Zeppelin aka the assault rifle. <laughs> that was not futuristic. <laughs> that looks like some shit from Bioshock bro. And that's actually an insult to Bioshock. Because Bioshock's a good game. Anyway. I, should, I guess I should sit, sit down near this quest now. What's the name of it? You have to talk to this guy. Good to be back in Diamond City. Nick's not the type to turn someone away, but he's only one person. I wonder so if it's broken. They... Actually, does the randomizer change the main quest? Can you not complete the game like this? Maybe. I don't think it's anything else because I've never had this bug before. No, there's literally um. There's nothing on the mod page that says it does that, so I don't know. Weird. Huh. Okay. Anyway, uh, I can just go do something else. <laughs> if the main quest is broken, who cares? I can just go have fun with the randomizer. The goal of this run isn't necessarily to beat- I mean, I was trying to, like, I was thinking of beating the game. Also, pressing Garby died at the start, so that may have bugged something out. Alternate start sometimes breaks it? Maybe. You the Fallout 4 assault rifle. How am I supposed to show you? Want me to like take my camera and uh, my, my Dark Souls posters? See? These are my Dark Souls and Elden Ring. My Dark Souls posters plus Bloodborne and Elden Ring because I uh, obviously those are the best games ever made. There you go, you can see them. They're really nice. Bought these shits off it. Bro, look look at those. Look look at all How do I This shit okay. <laughs> but you, you get the point. I was trying to point, but like doing it in reverse is so weird. Yeah, they're really pretty. Good art. Oh, we got flashbang. Anyway, yeah, those look really cool. Love that shit. Is this good? Wait, might as well fix that. It's kind of like that angle, right? It looks wrong. Okay, that's better. Good angle. There you go, bud. Fish. <clears throat> alternate start breaks your game? Hmm. Maybe. It could be the alternate start mod, actually. I could put that down lower in my load order. Maybe that'll fix it. Which one am I using? I'm using, uh, whatchamacallit? Start me up? I'll put that lower in the load order. Maybe that'll fix it. Anyway. Like I said, we can just go do something else for now. Like, the whole point, just... I'm not too worried about the story right now. I'm just having fun with the randomizer. 
see what wacky encounters I get into, you know? I still have the objective to greet the dog, that's funny. Maybe we should go greet the dog. I wonder if the dog meat's still alive. It's possible. Okay, my game crashed. Hmm. I was gonna say it was it was it's been a while since I crashed, so. Okay. Anyway. Well that sucks. See if there's a fish sword mod? Maybe. Imagine if dog me got randomized into a death claw. <laughs> There is no enemy randomizer, it's just weapons. Maybe I could do something like that where it's both combined. That would be ridiculous, though. That might actually crash my game 24-7, though. So, maybe not. Does Fallout 4 or Starfield have the worst guns? It's close. It's very close. I would say just maybe Fallout 4 because they look uglier on the surface. When it comes down to it, they're both... Starfield and Fallout 4, both the guns, mechanically, are terrible. But if you if you look at the guns in Starfield from far away, they don't look quite as bad. Because they, they're not made of trash. Like, the pipe guns are literally made of trash, and so they're ugly. They're just ugly no matter what. Like, I can understand someone looking at, like, some of the guns in Starfield and like, Oh, these don't look too bad. But then once you actually look at them up close, you're like, Oh yeah, these are pretty fucking bad. Uh, but in some ways, they're worse. In some ways, they're better. You know. One step forward, two steps back. Oh, sweet. Get the donation. Let's go, baby. Let's go. <sighs> From GK Games. Thank you very much for the five bucks. Thank you very much. Really appreciate that. He said, here, have five Robux. <laughs> Is that what the R stands for? The R dollars? He's donating me Robux? I'm gonna go launch freaking... Um, uh oh, gonna go run, <laughs> launch Roblox and play that instead. That's what I. <laughs> Five Robux, bro. What do you think about Fallout Miami? That mod's not out yet, is it? It's not out yet. But I mean, I do think it's cool. I can't wait for it to come out because I. It, there's no way it came out yet, bro. They have been releasing some standalone mods, though. I did use quite a few of those. They're cool. Like, Fallout Miami and Fallout London. Can't wait for those to come out. Anyway, this time I'll just go to Cambridge. Hopefully it doesn't crash. It's not gonna crash, I swear. It'll be fine. Any opinions on Titanfall firearms? Pfft, never played it, so I wouldn't know. Unfortunately. Is Titanfall like an Xbox only thing? I don't know. Never played it, sadly. I've heard people say it's a good game, though. Yes. Let me in. Oh, it's PlayStation only. Okay, I got it confused. That's funny. <laughs> I just assumed because I. Like, Titanfall and Halo, like, they're both futuristic sci-fi, so I was like... I don't know, I guess I got this mixed up. That's interesting. Oh no, this guy's saying Titanfall 2 is on PC. Okay. Oh, it's, it's so it's like... But it's not on Xbox, though. It's like PlayStation and PC exclusive. That's interesting. No, it's also on Xbox. You guys are just fucking lying. So it's available on everything. Why'd this guy say it was only on PlayStation? Bro, this guy's just straight up lying. <laughs> bro. Stop lying, bro. <laughs> People, that's why you can't trust anybody on the internet. <laughs> it's exclusive to the Nintendo DS. Finally. Finally, this guy's making sense. <laughs> All you guys saying it's available on Xbox and PS4 are lying. It's only on Nintendo DS. <laughs> it's a mobile game. It's a <laughs> it's only on Android. If you intend to stay That's funny. Outstanding. An N64 exclusive, yes. I, only I agree. Truth, you fall in line, you stay in line. 
You have such an infectious laugh, Lamau. Thank you. I get that a lot. Kind of a goofy, silly laugh, you know. I got all kinds of laughs, you know. I got the little giggle, like the hee 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 hee, and also the ha ha ha. A little bit of everything. A lot of variety, you know. Uh, thank you. Sure. I don't even know. I'm not even paying attention to dialogue. Nobody pays attention to dialogue in this game, especially if you played it 500 times. Ad victoriam means to victory in our eyes. Our rallying now. Hmm. Anyway, what? Right, I gotta do some stupid little side missions or something? I don't want to do all that. That's lame. Yeah. Um. I can't do the Minutemen quest. Wait, if I go, I want to say I want to go back here. Can I talk to Preston? Cause like he's dead. It says report back to Preston. Oh, I can't fast travel. No wait, because I thought they were supposed to take you up to the Pridwin, but the Pridwin's not here yet. Because um, you need to do the you need to kill Kellogg before the Pridwin shows up. So they can't take you to the Pridwin until that. Why is everyone saying fish in the? Why is everybody saying fish? What the fuck? Stop saying fish. Stop saying fish. <laughs> Great. One of the brotherhoods. I have a fish kill. Here, this should cover all the good luck, and be careful. Okay, cool. I'll just accept this quest that I'm never gonna do. Oh, this guy. All right, out with it. What's your game? I don't have time for this. I don't understand why this guy dislikes you so much. Literally, no reason. I didn't even do anything. So I can't figure out why you're sticking around. You got what you want. Literally unfishable right now. I want to help people. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, sure. Give me a quest that I'll never do. Blah, 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 blah. Shut up. Oh, clear out College Square. I can do that. I thought I already killed all these guys. Turn on subtitles? Why? I'm just going to skip the dialogue anyway. No reason. That's bugged out. Uh. Anyway. Yeah, I was gonna say I want to try and go talk to Preston over here. If he's. It still has the objective, which is funny. Can I? I can just resurrect him if I want to, right? Hmm. If I want, I could use a uh, console commands to try and advance the quest line. The the main quest, I mean. Yeah, Preston's still dead over here. He's still chilling. Look. Oh yeah, you still. I mean, I'm, I'm just curious. I think it's the resurrect command. Oh yeah. Okay, it does work. That was a pretty amazing. I think we should just leave him dead though. That'd be funny. That's a shame. <laughs> Listen. Oh, I'm surprised that does work though. Hey. Nice. Know? That's a pretty useful hey. command. We should kill him again though. Can I back out? <laughs> Get shot in the head by 50 BMG. What are you, crazy? That's hilarious. Anyway, I'll leave him dead for now. <laughs> I'll just leave him there. He's chilling. Let's see. Murder. I do want to continue the main quest because I want to kill Kellogg, you know? Hmm. I want to look it up real quick. What's the name of the quest? Fallout 4 quest IDs. Act 1. Getting a clue. That's the name of it. What's the quest I do to this one? Copy that. Uh. Set stage, quest ID, stage number, yeah. This is stage 10. Oh, wait. 
set stage. That work? I don't see it. It's weird. Uh, let's do that again, but twenty. It's not even showing up. Okay. Maybe it's just bugged. Set zero zero. Do you have to do that to start the quest? That is the quest ID. Hmm. I don't know. That is that is the correct ID though. Uh <laughs> Okay. Interesting. Show quest log. Hold on. That's weird. It didn't even... Like this video, or this quest did get completed. Maybe it was just broken. I think it's just broken. I can uh, I can worry about that later. You know, let's look, let's actually go do a side quest then. Let's just make it to where my goal is to get a kill with every single weapon. Then I should make a checklist. Uh, where's it at? There it is. Cleansing the Commonwealth. Let's clear our College Square. You know, let's actually go do one of the side quests. Let's go do that. That sounds like fun. Stop saying fish. <laughs> the fishing mini game. Oh, you know what? I should install the uh, the fishing mod. Have you all seen the fishing mod for Fallout 4? It's actually really cool. This is dope. This is kind of bugging out. Oh, I have to go to the metro, don't I? That's okay. Oh, hello. That's a big dude. That's so groovy. There we go. I got Sergeant Ash again, seriously? Nice hairline. <laughs> Did I just one-shot him with a bash? That's hilarious. Easy money. <laughs> oh, sweet, a medium plate. That's awesome. Give me that. Oh yeah, yeah, oh yeah, yeah. Did my man say doing a side quest is fun? Oh yeah. Might as well do this in the meantime. Because my main quest is kind of broken. I forgot about that. I'll see if I can fix it later. If not, then maybe we could just run over and do a DLC. You know. I think the DLC should still work. I got a shortcut. Easy to, easy to. I shred it straight through that guy. Oh, did I get the MA4 flashbang? Okay. You know what? I still want to use it though. Oh. Yep, it worked. See, it stunned him. Hi. Right. Oh, not the syringer. I'm stuck in a corner. This can't be good. Bruh. Can this even kill him? Mm, does like one damage. That's something. This is gonna be fun. <laughs> it does no damage. Bruh. Stop slapping me. He broke my armor. Wow. His slaps can penetrate through steel armor. He he's almost there, guys. There we go. That was... That wasn't too bad, actually. His slaps weren't that, even that powerful, you know? <laughs> That's what I was saying. Yeah, the bash should be a lot a lot more effective. 
I still want to like try and use use the gun for its intended purpose, at least a little a little bit. Bashing's up here. <laughs> Screw that! I'm moving it. I shot him through the wall. <laughs> I blew his arm off through the wall. That's hilarious. Nice. Wow, that was a super fun side quest, guys. I love doing radiant quests, guys. It's the best part of the whole game. Is this oil? Look, I'm gonna I'm gonna blow it up. I guess not. Okay, I guess laser guns don't blow up oil. Makes sense. That is definitely a syringe gun moment. Dude's in the chest still spamming fish. <laughs> fish oil. <laughs> this guy, bro. <laughs> That's so funny. Anyway. What was that? That was a beauty. Hello. I'm... Okay, we got... Uh-oh. Imagine being able to tank a 308 to the freaking face, man. That's crazy. It's a freaking nightcap. A whole magazine. That's impressive. He ate like... Well, I mean, I did miss a few shots, but that dude took a whole magazine of 9mm. That's impressive. I mean, they're super mutants. It makes sense. Very realism. Whoa! Uh-oh. I'm 1 HP. And he broke my leg. I have no stem. I have no stem packs. Okay, I shot it in with the vector though. Do I seriously have no stem packs? Oh, I do. It's not safe for some reason. Huh. Anyway. Nice. I was gonna say, I got another donation there. From Baby Carrots. Two dollars for Baby Carrots. Thank you very much. I really appreciate the donation. I love you. Let's see, he said. AK-74U or Mark-18 slash AKM or M4 slash AK-74M4. Is, is that a question? Like, you ask me to pick which gun's better? Is that what you're, is that what you're saying? Because obviously, obviously. Let's see, there it is on the overlay. Damn, that shit's hella delayed. Three different questions, so you're asking me to pick. Uh, obviously, I'm going with the, with the M4 every time. Mark-18 every time. AR fanboy. Just to be that guy. I'm when I wouldn't know. I'm sadly I don't own an AK. It'd be nice to. I only shot one one time. That's what I'm saying, man. I need, I need to get big on YouTube so I can just go buy a bunch of guns. That's my that's my sole purpose in life. Oh, hold up, my forearms are cramping. Um, <laughs> but of course, for, for my first gun, I wouldn't have just bought an AR instead. I'm more familiar with that platform. I definitely want to buy an AK at some point, though. I'm not going to sit here and say the, a the, a the AR is vastly superior to the AK. They're both very popular for a reason, because they're both good. You can't deny that. If you, if you try and say this one's objectively better, then you're just dumb. They're both good. But definitely want to get an AK at some point. Very fun. Very cool. Well, shoot. With the main quest not working, what do I do in the meantime? I guess I'll report back and get my freaking... The freaking, uh... Motherfucking caps. I guess so. Huh. Go over and start like. See, so if if, I, if I'm gonna start a DLC, I'd like to save that for later. It's tough being out here in the oh, wait. All alone. I'll tell you this, loser. You right, not you. Where's reset? Okay. Scary. Over here. About time you showed your face. I take it that area is clear. Yes. Affirmative. Up and I may start believing you got some real now report to Pal Welcome back. I've got another mission for you. Outstanding. Over the years, the Brotherhood has sent several Another mission. Oh yeah, it's this mission. I was I was about to say it's like he's not taking me up to the Bridwood. Yeah, this is the mission to go save uh not save, to track down the missing squad. They're in search and I remember finding this this mission by myself for the first time without even finding the Brotherhood, which was interesting. It was pretty neat to actually track him down. <sighs> anyway. Well, shoot. 
I still want to try and debug that quest, though. Because I would like to kill Kellogg. That's, that's like my goal, honestly. Reset quest. I'm going to do a reset quest. I mean, that wouldn't make sense. Yeah, maybe, maybe I'll try that. Maybe I'll try that. Reset quest. Maybe I use the editor ID? Is it the editor ID or the... Or the form ID? Oh, wait. Reset. Uh, I still don't see it. Hold on. It just says quest ID. Okay. Let me try the set stage command again with the, with the other ID. This shit is not working. Can someone help me out here? How, how do I... Um, set the stage to start this damn quest to talk to Valentine? I could, what I could do, I mean, I guess I could go back to a previous save and, well, no, that wouldn't work because it's too far back. Yeah. That'd be too far back. I don't want to do all that shit all over again. Oh, well. I'm going to try and do some, I'm going to try to do some console commands to get this shit to work. Because obviously this shit's broken right now. If it is the randomizer causing it, then uh, maybe I'm just being dumb. Yeah, the, the name of the quest is called Getting a Clue. That's the quest that comes right after uh, finding Nick. After Right after Unlikely Valentine. I save Nick, then Getting a Clue automatically triggers right after that. Because I told Nick, oh yeah, I'll meet you back at Diamond City, right? I told him that. And then the quest just never activated. And then I went to the agency. These quest commands just do not fucking work. This is, okay. This is really stupid. Where, where's the damn quest at? I don't know. Let's see if you guys said anything. Stop talking about fish. Clicking Nick and typing reset AI. I'm not sure if that would do anything. Um, maybe I could try something like that. Set stage 30? I could try different stages until something works. So this thing, the quest won't even show up. It doesn't even work at all. I could just complete the quest entirely. None of these commands are working at all. The set stage command does not work. What the fuck? Okay. Um, what if I go back to the previous quest, right? And do set stage command on that one and do like to the last objective. Um, this is really stupid. The fact that I even have to do this shit is really, really dumb. One ten. The set stage command does not work. I. Th I don't know. Maybe it's something to do with the randomizer. Maybe the randomizer just. Locks you out from the main quest. I don't know. Maybe it's the alternate start. Hmm. Okay, there's this guy. Copy that. Yes. That's not working. 
Uh, it, it doesn't work. Uh, there's some bullshit. I don't know. Main quest is bugged. Can't do it. Can't do it, bro. It's just, it's just broken. Stages only go forward, not back. How do I start a quest? How do I how do I start a quest? I don't need to set a stage necessarily. I just need to actually get it to show up in my quest log because it's not working. Stupid. I'm gonna copy this random thing I just got on Google. Oh. See, I tried I tried it on this quest, and this one works. This one works just fine, actually. What? Guys, I can beat the game now. Look, I got the nuclear option. <laughs> See? Guys, let's go finish the game. That Okay, so the set stage... It's literally just that one quest that's bugged. It's literally just that single quest, I swear. Okay. No, wait, 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 okay. Actually, let me try doing the quest right after getting a clue then. Right? Let me, let me try the one right after. Right after. Reunions. Let me, do, let me do it on reunions. Yeah. That one doesn't work. Nuclear option works, though. Maybe, maybe I have to, like, reload my... Save and... Because, like, obviously, if you have the nuclear option unlocked, then the, other, then the other quest is, like, already completed, I guess. Let me see. That one doesn't work. You know what? Hold on. Let me go check on somebody real quick. Let me go check. Last time I tried this, the game crashed. Um. Yeah, dog meat's fucking dead. That's why. Okay. I think the reason why the quest is bugging out is because dog meat died. Cause like you need dog meat, <laughs> dude. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Oh, dude. I... The reason why the main quest is bugged is do dog meat fucking died earlier. Cause I had the remember earlier when when Preston died, I had the mod installed which um, disables essential actors. That's probably why the main quest is bugged. Cause you need dog meat, so it, it didn't know what to do. It literally had no clue what to do. See, now it works. Literally, the whole reason why it was bugged is because Dogmeat fucking died. That's hilarious. Okay. Um, well, obviously, I don't want to start reunions just yet. Or, you know, I could anyway. But there's really no reason for me to... Um, I guess I'll do it anyway, but yeah. I figured it out. I figured it out, guys. I'm a fucking genius. Yeah. But let me go back and I'll start get the getting a clue one. Although that one, all you do is just break into his house. But whatever. I guess I'll do it. Follow the rules. That's hilarious, though. That's a that's that's really weird. The the game checks to see if dog meat's alive, to make sure that you can do that quest instead of just spawning in a new one. It's really interesting. Hmm. Yeah. Like I understand why they have essential actors. But you shouldn't have a game made to where you need an essential actor to complete the game. That's why New Vegas is so fucking brilliant. Because you don't need any... There's literally not a single NPC you need in that game to, to beat the game. All you need is Yes Man. And Yes Man can't die because he's an AI. There we go. Okay. Nice. Oh my goodness. Wow. That's hilarious. <laughs> That's actually hilarious. Wow. That's a big bro moment. What a huge headache. I wasted like an hour of my time trying to figure that shit out. Okay. Now we can actually go kill Kellogg now. Because that's what I want to do. Before the night's over, I want to kill Kellogg. I want to blow I want to blow up his bald ass head. That's the goal. 
Because I do want to beat the game with a randomizer. That'd be cool. That's like the whole goal. And also just get as many kills as possible. Try, try and get a kill with a, um, each weapon. Although I do have a checklist, and that'd be really cumbersome, but... You know, anyway. Looks like Ellie wants to say something to you. Shut up. Always a trail to be followed. Okay. Okay, we're back on track. It was not the alternate start mod. Dogmate just fucking died. We're open for business again. What? Excuse me? You so much me out of that vault. I'm here. Stop. Okay, let me just... Talk to Ellie. She handles... All the finances. So it's not working? Sit down. Okay. There we go. We're trying to find someone who's gone missing. Yes. Whoo, yep. Uh, my boy. Yeah, my boy. Maybe I should have just skipped the reunions, honestly. Well, there. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Then you got the newer models, good as human. Uh, First of all, read some comments. What's the armor mod? It's called Gunner Armor Expansion. It's really nice. Very tactical. Look, we got the little gunner patch right there too. Right. Uh. Wait. You didn't download any Nick Romance mods? No. No. I'm not gonna do that. The description matches. I didn't even know there was a romance mod for, for Nick Valentine. Yeah, that's right. The house in the abandoned West Stand. <sighs> yeah, no way. No way. No way, bro. I don't believe you. Follow Nick. Sheesh. That's what I'm saying. You need dog meat for the previous one, too, yeah. Because he calls in dog meat right after you get out of uh, Kellogg's house. Damn, it's dark. Holy moly, that's dark. Maybe a bit too dark. <laughs> Never seen someone work this hard for Bethesda. Bethesda tier story. Yeah. I just, because like, the whole point of a challenge run is like beat the main quest or whatever. So like, that's what I kind of want to do. You know. Right, like title the video like, can I beat Fallout 4 with a weapon randomizer? All right, that's the whole point. That's the whole point of the video. Yeah. Give me a sec. Hold your horses. Hold your horses. Open it. You know what? I'll just shoot it open. Yeah. I broke it. Okay. Uh, let me just. You guys didn't see that. Okay. Uh, Maybe I'll just go get the key then. Shoot. <laughs> Let's hope I can just break it open with the... If you had a shotgun, I think there's a higher chance of breaking it open if you had a shotgun. Oh wait, do I have to talk to Nick to get the key? Shit. Maybe I do. Okay, let, let, me, let me reload that one more time then. Blah, 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 blah. See if you can't get that door to open. It's too difficult. Stubborn lock, ain't it? Yep. Go ahead and so I can talk to you. Let me talk to you so I can go trigger the quest marker. Sheesh. Yeah. Now it gives me the quest marker to go over there. Because oh, I'm not sure if the dialogue would actually activate with the Geneva Convention girl. We probably have to talk to Nick first, because, you know, that's just how Bethesda games work. This is a certified Bethesda moment. <laughs> you guys said I thought I would see Giga Chad, but it's just Jesus. That's what everyone's been saying, bro. A ripped Jesus? <laughs> I wouldn't say I'm ripped, but... There now. I would say I'm swole. Can I just go pickpocket Mr. McDonough? <laughs> right in front of his face, bro. That was so stupid. <laughs> I have no perks in pickpocketing. What were the chances of that? Was it like a 20% chance, maybe? 
That was that was that was so stupid. Oh, that's the slowest elevator in the world. How convenient. Why is it so dark? Because it's nighttime. Duh. Did you know that? Did you guys know that if you go outside when it's nighttime, uh, it's dark. That's crazy. No way. <laughs> no, I know what you're saying though, because compared to Vanilla Fallout 4, this is pretty dark. Oh. It's probably also because of NACX, actually. NACX also makes it a little bit... But the EMB makes it even darker. More colorful. More contrast. I can make it a little bit brighter. Uh, it's also because there's no moonlight, really, going on. There should be. Is it a full moon? Let me see. The adaptation changes it. So that made it a little bit brighter. I think it's the minimum that makes it brighter. Oh, no. Now this is realistic. <laughs> no, it's a little bit, uh... Oh. Ooh, that's really blue. I actually kind of like that. Hold on. If I turn the adaptation all the way down to, like, zero, that just makes it... Oh, hold on. Oh! Oh! Hey! Yeah, see, I'm kind of messing with this stuff too much now. Why is the sky blue? Uh, the sky is blue because of chemicals in the atmosphere. I don't know, something like that. But yeah, um, obviously it shouldn't be that colorful. Where's it, where's the setting at? Point oh oh one two. That was like point two two. Point two two. I'll do something like that, and make it slightly brighter, but I don't want to make it, you know, too bright. I know what you're saying though, because like it's like pitch black. Look at this. If I look in this direction, <laughs> it's just black. Like the flashlight's necessary, but I kind of like that because you know having a flashlight's cool. It makes it more uh, spooky, you know. Let's take a look around. Kellogg must have left something. Should also go like take a nap and advance it back to daytime. Wow. Like, how is this wire even connected to that hidden door? Oh, actually, I can see that. But you don't see the wire. All of thing. You don't see the wire coming out from under the desk, though. It's not very immersive. It's literally using Bluetooth. Because, look, this wire is connected to this part of the desk. But then you don't see the wire come out from under the desk and up to the ceiling over here. You know? Uh, literally using Bluetooth. You know? Interesting brand. Show you a wiggly diggly head as a boy. Let me sell all this shit. Hmm. Blah 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 blah. Well. Skipping dialogue be like. <laughs> it's just dead silence. The dialogue's bugged. <laughs> it's just staring at him. That's just funny. Let me just shoot this double bag. That'll unlock it. Genius. You know, I, I don't feel like picking all this shit up. Okay, dog mate. Show me the way. I'm all out of fucking water. I've been sipping on dry air for the past, like, 30 minutes. Okay. Now we can go kill Kellogg. Now we can play the game. Before we do that, I'm going to go take a nap because I do not want to be tre trekking through the dark. I want to be able to see what I'm shooting at. Thank you. You ever played Metro? Oh, yeah. Dude, I love Metro games. Metro games are dope. I want to go play them again, honestly. They're that good. Especially Exodus. Exodus was really great. I hope they keep making more. The only thing that sucks about the Metro games is that there's not much replayability. You just do the same linear quest line. That's it. Exodus was a little bit better because, like, it's a little bit more open world. But... Definitely not nearly as much replayability as Fallout, which sucks because they're way better games. Oh, here we go. Wait, I think I did rent this room okay. earlier. Can I still sleep here? Nope. Gotta rent it again. Yes. Wait, I'm, I was about to shoot him in the face. Let me rent a room. Oh. Help! Help! Security! Security! 
Whoops. Okay. I guess I gotta shoot him now. <laughs> I'm just gonna shoot his kneecaps. Is he? Oh, he's invincible. That's lame. Thousand damage. Gotta go on a massacre. Oh, I got the finger gun. <laughs> so many essential actors. Oh, you know what I should do? I could just make it to where I just, I just go through the whole game and just kill everybody with the with the weapon randomizer. I think that'd be more interesting, actually. Once like once I get the Brotherhood called in. Hold on, I got a um, donation there. But I was, I was gonna say once I get the Brotherhood called in, I could just turn on the um, tur turn off the essential actors and just go kill everybody with a random with the, with the weapon randomizer. That'd be funny. <laughs> Uh, anyway, I was gonna say I got a donation there. Let me check that out. Five dollars there, or five five euros from my boy God's Helix. Thank you very much for the five euros. I really appreciate that. He said, "Hey man, thanks for the chill streams. Do you have any recommendations for good, high quality quest mods? Quest mods. I haven't played too many quest mods for Fallout Four." Um, if you consider Sim Settlements as a quest mod, well, it does add it, it does add quest, which is cool. So like Sim Settlements Chapter Two and Chapter Three, I haven't even played Chapter Three yet, but Sim Settlements is definitely a good mod. You know, makes the settlement part of the game much more fleshed out, and actually has good, cool characters, good dialogue, and a pretty interesting storyline as well. I actually really like that, so I would recommend that one. I haven't played any other ones really besides that one. Um, any other any other ones that are like. High quality, I would say. Yeah, I'm not going to look them up right now, but th that's probably the best one out there, I would say. Anyway, let's get back to it. Let's actually go rent a room. Oh, here we go. I got to wait through this dialogue, though. That's lame. Oh. Dude's in the chat right. still saying fish. They were keeping that up for quite a while. I'm surprised. Diamond City of Radio <laughs> is terrible, yes? Makes you want this dude said Brandy is built like Liberty world. Prime. <laughs> Bro, Li Liberty Prime is literally me, bro. Literally me. I must destroy all communism. Do I seriously have to talk to this guy? Yeah, it's pretty bad. Don't care. Didn't ask. Plus, you're Russian. You know. I don't even know what they're talking about. I'm just clicking buttons. Okay. Oh yeah, it's the confidence man quest. That's what it is. Let me rent a room. Room two is yours. Thank you. I'm gonna go to sleep. I could have just fast traveled back to Red Rocket. Now that I think about it. But I mean, you know, sometimes I like being immersive. You know, like it's it's so immersive to to rent a room. You know, just like just like in the good old Skyrim days. I actually love doing that. I don't know about y'all, but whenever I play Skyrim, like with survival mods turned on. I actually go out of my way to like rent out the rooms and inns because I think it's cool. And plus you, in Skyrim, you actually have to rent an inn to sleep because you can't build a bed or anything. Unlike in Fallout. So like inns were actually useful in Skyrim. These guys still saying fish, god dang. I'm, 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 that's impressive. Although I will say, it is kind of a, you know, oh my goodness. Holy moly. That's quite red. <laughs> like my entire face is red. <laughs> Isn't this supposed to cause radiation damage? I guess not. I am wearing a gas mask, by the way, so I should register this mask as a gas mask, actually. Oh, see. Yeah. Yeah, um, I should do that. Where's the... Uh... The gas mask debug thingy. Hold on, guys. Gas mask database. Yeah, that's what we need. Oh, wait. Okay. Uh, anyway, thought I forgot something. I'm good. a goofy little way of doing it. Headgear. 
Yeah. Bad mask. And now it works. It just works. And again, and again. It just works. See, now I'm protected. Boy, I still need to put on the filter. I'm actually not taking much radiation damage from the storm, though, so, uh. Weird. Did that even work? Hold on. Uh, it's the the filter's not equipping. Do it this way. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm not taking red damage. No, actually, I am taking a little bit. L let me go figure this out real quick. I'm confused. Uh, radiation weather only. I should be taking a lot more, actually. But, uh, whatever. I'm fine, I guess. Maybe I should just go back to sleep, honestly. Yeah. Maybe I should just do that. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Filter machine broke, yeah. Maybe the gas mask mod is bugged now, too. Everything's just bugged. Everything's broken. I'll just sleep and hopefully the storm goes away. That'd be great. Let us see. You're not going to always cheat the weather, too. Nope. Oh, wait. It says radioactive, but should be fine, actually. Okay. Now I need to fix that HUD, because that HUD's going to annoy the hell out of me. Oh, you know what? Maybe it's because I set it to where it's on easy mode? No, it's on radiation only. Huh. I don't know. Maybe it's something to do with my load order, actually. So, um... I'm gonna have to fix that. It's not, it's not very immersive, you know. Okay, we've got that. You know what? Hold on. I need to fix that. It needs to be perfect. It needs to be precise. I think you understand. Also, every single time I move my forearm like this, it freaking seizes up. I don't know about y'all, but if y'all ever work out your forearms, like, do y'all ever get forearm cramps? I've been getting some mad forearm cramps, bro. And I've been working on my forearms real hard, you know? Be going till failure every single set. I'm a dog like that. That looks good. Okay. Where's dog meat? Is dog meat? Why is he still inside Kellogg's house? What are you doing, bro? What a goober. <laughs> Stupid. Okay, I gotta go the long way. I hate this game. This is probably the worst game ever made. I can't fucking stand it. <laughs> they made it seriously to put the stairs away over here. You just wasted 10 seconds of my valuable time. You didn't finish the dog dialogue? Whoops. <laughs> Whoopsie. I'd be forgetting. Oh, there he is. Come on, dog mate. Huh. That's weird. Uh, let me take some right away, by the way. Yeah, uh, it's not working, actually. I think it's just bugged. Probably because he died earlier. I just... Yeah, I just broke, actually. Let me do the set stage quest again. Let me set stage to the next... Uh, check on dog meat. Oh, no. Set stage 11. Let's do that. Hmm. That didn't work. weird you know I'll just let's do that I'll just do that I'll just skip to that part I already know where to go so here now 
Okay. Anyway. <laughs> Very silly. <laughs> yeah. I could just go to Kellogg, you're right. That's what I'm doing. I got everything. I'll be fine. Ugh. Cause I'm 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 gonna kill Kellogg before the night's over. That's that's my goal. That's that's what I'm here for. I just want to destroy his bald ass head. Hopefully, with a really funny weapon. That'd be really funny if I killed Kellogg with like a Nerf gun, or a finger gun, or a or the diamond sword, or the rainbow gun. <laughs> That'd be silly. Uh, I'm like extra tired today. I'm like, whew, you know, I just, I just work out so hard, guys. I'm all suckered out. Ooh, got another, another, another dono there. Let's go, baby. Another donation there. Two bucks for my boy. Just your average, uh, average Florida something. I can't see the rest of it. Your average Florida man, I'm guessing. Anyway, thank you very much for the two dollars. He said. You ever sploing boing your your bebops? Yeah, all the time. I'll be slinging and boinging, twenty four seven. Oh look, is the that's funny. Search clues. I guess I don't I don't need to do that. I can just run straight to Fort Hagen though. Uh, let's see, where's that place at? Oh, it's already marked. Okay. Now it shows up. See. How silly is that? I was running run along this main highway. What the hell is that? Big ass gecko. <laughs> Just fucking smoked a gecko, man. Thank you, man. Oh, I got the diamond sword. Let's go, baby. Whack. Oh, I'm out of nails. Hold on, hold on. I need to cheat in nails real quick. I'm cheating, guys. That's one of the ammo types I forgot to add. That's a humongous Cazador. Please don't kill me. I'm gonna die. There we go. Get this thing away from me. I can't see. Why is what? What was that? Okay. Is that a bear? What the fuck? Okay, let me make sure to cheat in nails before I start. Um, anyway, I got another donation there. For my boy, Bigger Joe Gaming with the 99 cents. Let's go, baby. Thank you very much for the donation. Really appreciate it. A lot of donations tonight. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you everyone for supporting the channel. Keeps me motivated. Keeps me going, man. That's, that's what I wake up for every single day. Was that a Roblox oof? Yeah. <laughs> I got the Roblox oof death sound effect. I, I got a few silly mods here and there. You know. I, it, and this guy saying I'm cheating. I'm not cheating. It's part of the mod. Part of the mod, it gives you ammunition. It gives you like thousands of ammunition to, at the start of the game. But um, I wasn't able to cheat in. Like, not cheat in. Uh, I wasn't able to mod in. Like, get the script to work with modded ammunition. I tried doing it. I tried typing in like the form IDs and putting it on the on the list, but it just didn't work for some reason, so I'm just doing it to where like I just cheat in the ammunition. Whenever I if, if I so happen to not have added it at the start of the game. There's still quite a few ammo types I forgot about. I'm just adding them as I go, you know. Anyway, let's try this again. Wait, did I type in death? I think I to type that in. Let me type that in. I forgot to do it. Okay. Sometimes I forget. I don't know if there's like an automatic thing that, that would do it. That'd be nice though. I'd... Now we're gonna add crash too. What the fuck? That's some bullshit. Okay. That one was completely random too. I swear, bro. It's because I alt tabbed. It's it literally has to be because I alt tabbed. Because Fallout Four and any Bethesda game is gets really finicky when you alt tab for some reason. Because I alt tab to type in death, right? I typed in death when I alt tabbed, and I alt tab back in, and my game immediately crashed, bro. I'm telling you. Had to be the alt tab. 
Mark Bethesda game is so dog shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> Why are they so buggy? I mean, to be fair, I'm running a bunch of mods, but like that's something that would still happen with a vanilla game, though. It definitely happened. To, it happened with me like a. It happens with Skyrim a lot, especially. Skyrim was really bad about alt tabs. Like if you alt tabbed on that game, pff, your game's frozen, buddy. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> You're screwed. <laughs> Yeah. Wait for this shit to fucking oh back up. Hey, who you real real? Me 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 me. Let me pull up the fucking. Oh wait, should I just alt tabbed? Whoops. Uh, there we go. Oh, don't forget the second cursor. Yeah, the freaking. Oh, did I hate that one? Like sometimes the. The regular cursor will pop up in game two. That one's really annoying. I literally have to restart my game when that shows up. Not just Bethesda games. Yeah, that's true. A, a lot of PC games do have the alt tab issue. That's true. Can't blame just Bethesda, but then again, like, this really shouldn't be an issue with any game. You have the dart gun? No, I don't have the dart gun. From Fallout 3? I don't remember that being in Fallout 3. Oh, so we, okay, so we use a mod. Okay. I'll put that down on the, on the list as well. We got a bunch of bunch of stuff we need to add. Dark gun, lightsabers, stuff like that. You know. You got any more suggestions, always let me know. I want to try and get it to where there's like 200, 200, uh, 200 mods in the, in the, in the randomizer. That'd be dope. Maybe, I don't think I'd get to 300 because at some point I will run out of space. Like, you can only have so many mods loaded into, into Fallout at one time. You only have so many plugins, at least. Hold on, I got another donation there from Dex for $2. The two Robux. I got two Robux, let's go, baby. So I'm so distracted, I just mag-dumped and missed all my shots. That's hilarious. <laughs> just bashed him to death. Anyway, get the two Robux for my boy Dex. Thank you very much. He said, be, be wary. There might be pineapple on your lasagna. Who the fuck would put pineapple on lasagna? That sounds nasty. Sheesh. Like, I, like pineapple on pizza is good. Pie, pineapple on lasagna? What the fuck? Why is this rad rat doing so much damage and eating so many bullets? I just got ratted. I just got absolutely ratted. What the fuck? Dude! I need to stop- I need to stop looking at chat. I got distracted. <laughs> that rat! He was taking 7 damage per shot. Like, his damage resistance was stupid high for some reason. I need to fix that. I'll try it again, but, um... Dude, he, he like bit me one time, and he took off like 75% of my health in like one bite. I'm like, damn, dude, that was a big-ass bite. You know? <laughs> anyway. Got another donation there for my boy. Bigger Joe Gaming. Back at it again. $2.99. See, now it pops up. Or as I say that. Thank you very much, Bigger Joe. With the $3 there. Very nice. I really appreciate it. And as always, you know, with the Super Chats. You might as well go ahead and leave a comment on it. Might as well. And I'll read it. Ooh, fat man. But if you rather just donate in silence, that's that's cool as well. I'm cool with that. Okay, I'm gonna go shoot over here. There's something over there. What is that? Like a big ass toad? I killed it. <laughs> that was oh, that's a bear. Oh, I'm gonna die. That's a big oof. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay. How did I lose half my health again? Because, like, I was half health before that bear even got to me. I don't know. Did something hit me? That's definitely a fish issue. That's for sure. Level 70 rat, yeah. Rat's OP. That bear's OP. He mauled me in one hit. I died instantly. How many crashes today? Uh, th three. 
Three crashes today, which is less than yesterday, but still too much, obviously. Still entirely too much. 11 crashes in total for for uh, how many hours of gameplay? Not even four hours of total gameplay? Wow, that's pretty bad. That is exceptionally bad, actually. Sheesh. Like I said last time, the, something to do with the, having the randomizer combined with all these mods makes it more prone to makes it more prone to crashing than usual. Damn, dude! Oh, my eyes still haven't adjusted from that explosion. What the hell? Let's see if I can one shot this bear. He's over here somewhere. Something just exploded. Okay, I guess she's not here this time. Oh my goodness. That's a fat ass Cazador. And I missed. Oh, it's a, ma it's a mag fed. A mag fed harpoon launcher. I forgot about that. That's hilarious. Ooh, chainsaw. No, not the thirst zapper! I'm dead. I'm already dead. It does no bash damage. This is literally a joke weapon. I'm literally guaranteed to die at this point. It does, it does no bash damage. It does no bash damage. <laughs> Literally. I'm... Oh, wait, 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 hold on. <gasps> it worked! Wait, what? Okay. It worked. And I died anyway, actually. What the fuck? Definitely a skill issue. Bro. What just hit me? There's so many animals. There are way too many animals. I can't even get past this little forest area. This is the forest of death. I want to try somewhere else. Maybe I should take the... Or, you know what? Maybe instead of just cutting through the forest and going along the railroad tracks, I'll cut through here. There you know. Maybe that'll be better. That'll be easier. I'm tired of dying at this point. Hello. You guys smoked. Oh, nice. Hunting revolver. The krill issue. Yeah, work smarter, not harder, exactly. Just usually whenever I play this game mindlessly and I'm reading chat, I tend to just play my, like, working harder, working mindlessly, you know? But then every once in a while, I'm like, okay, maybe I should turn my brain on now and actually do a strategy instead of just running in there bashing my head against the wall like a freaking buffoon. Mark. Damn, that's a tough dog. Oh. You know what? Maybe I should just keep this. It's funny having an invisible gun like that. It's part of the randomizer. It's supposed to be a USP-45. But, um... It's... There's something to do with the mesh. It's just invisible. Still works, though. Uh, what's that? A ghoul? Bonk. You've also got this thing, like, the randomizer... St I deleted all the vanilla weapons, but it's still giving me... ...modded weapons with vanilla names. Because, like, these modded weapons are being used to replace the vanilla weapons. So, I don't know how to get rid of the legendary effects, though. Because, like, th this... ...Balasong spawned in with a freezing... ...enchantment on it, like it's freaking Skyrim. Yeah, maybe I should just run around these dudes. Uh oh, there's a. What is that? That's a big ass bee. Oh come on. Is this okay? There we go. Oh great, another melee weapon. That's just what I wanted. Holy moly! There's a lot of a lot of stuff going on here. Nice. Damn, that's a tanky... I got a syringer. Are you kidding me? That was a tanky bee. Maybe I should just bash this guy. Oh, wait, yeah, that's good. I missed. That doesn't do much damage, though. If I do that, does that... Oh, okay. The And I got the finger gun. Wow, that's just what I wanted. <laughs> Dude. One shitty weapon to something just about the same level of shittiness. Actually, I would say the finger gun is better than the syringer. I don't know. They're about the same. 
don't know how much total damage the syringer does, but it's it's very slow. Very slow time to kill on that thing, though, that's for sure. Should I get the agony mod? Um, that mod's really old. I personally don't use it anymore. I wouldn't recommend it, actually. You could still use it, but I would say use something more simple. Like, I, like right now, I'm using Wasteland Wound Care. Oh, look at that equip animation. That's dope. Look at that. <laughs> <I didn't... laughs> look at the unequip. <laughs> That's so funny. Can I kill this giant fucking shrimp with my fingers? <laughs> I don't think so. I think I'm just going to run away. <laughs> Can I kill a Myrler King? <laughs> Here she does like a little whistle sound. But I can't really whistle that well, so. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Oh my. I, I, I'm not gonna kill a freaking rad scorpion with a finger. It does one damage. That's, that's not gonna work. I need to retreat. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm gonna be dealing with this guy for a while. I'll just keep running away. You can't get me if I keep running. <laughs> Two damage. Wow, that's that's pretty good. Maybe I can kill this guy. Ooh, oh yeah, dude! I just blew his head up with my mind. <laughs> that was so stupid. Can you? <laughs> What is going on? Dude! That guy was that guy was only wearing his underpants and a baseball cap. I walked up to him and I just went boop, 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 with my bare hands and I shot him with my finger gun. And then I started running and I got blown the fuck up by a missile launcher out of nowhere. I was like, what the fuck? Huh? And I'm all the way back here too, which is even better. Yeah, that dude had the martyrdom perk. That was wild. That one's definitely going in the final video. That was crazy. Holy moly. There'd be some wild encounters in this playthrough, that's for sure. Look how gloomy it is outside, too. Look at this. It's very gloomy. I actually like this. I like this weather. Very, very apocalyptic, you know. Very fallout. Just the average day in Britain, though. We're just overcast, you know. Anyway, let's try this again. Uh, hopefully. Uh, I don't get the shit-ass finger gun. That'd be great. Now, you see, if I add in more joke weapons, that'll just make it even harder, though. So maybe not... That, that's why I try to make it to where there's not too many joke weapons. Like, there should be a good ratio. I would say, like... A ratio of 90 to 10, maybe? I think I have it somewhere close to that. Because out of all the weapons that I have added, I would say maybe like 10 of them are joke weapons that are completely useless. Like the, like the fucking throwing pie. That's what it, wow, this doesn't do very like much damage. Wow, yeah, this guy's pretty... Res, this guy's resistant to punches, it seems. However, he does not have very good defense, though. He's not very good at blocking or countering attacks, is he? I'll kill him eventually. This is the same thing as, like, punching a super mutant. I mean, it's literally a super mutant zombie, so that's why. Or a ghoul, I should say. Are you kidding me? L just let me kill this guy first. Let's oh my lord! Okay. I got killed by fucking bees. You kidding me? Oh, wait. I need more armor. I need to put on my armor plate. That's probably why. That would help. You think an armor plate would, would, re would help against a bee sting? That was a really... Um, really lethal beasting, though. God dang. Yeah. Um, let me put type in death. I was gonna say, another thing with the armor plates, man, I just always forget when they're broken. Like, the only time you know when they're broken is when you hear the crack. But, like, I'm usually talking too much, so I can't even hear it. <laughs> Unbelievable, this guy, bro. <laughs> um... Yeah, I, I'm, I, I've said it before, but like, I would it would be really nice if the armor plate mod had like a little like an extra health bar, like a blue health bar right above the regular health bar, so you'd know 
what the status of your um, armor plate is, that'd be great. You know, just like in Warzone. Because that's what the mod is based on. The mod is based on the Warzone armor plates. Although I don't know how to, how it would work. Inter like, trying to implement like a new heads-up display element might be a little bit difficult. Especially when it comes to like an extra health bar that's connected to like a piece of equipment. Don't know how that would work. But the, mo the mod is still great as it is. Just that one little thing would make it perfect though. If it's possible. Can I, hello? I can't jump over this, okay. There I go. Whatever. See ya. What is this? Okay, it's a broken turret. I was about to say. I was confused. Well, this is the path that you usually go along. Yeah, I'll just go along this. Because you go along this, then there's like a bridge that takes you across. I was trying to just cross the river. Oh. Ow. Oh, no. Okay, we got him. No scope. This is kind of intrusive. Nice. Oh, I got a flashbang. That's great. Does this work on bugs? Let me see. Oh, it's a... What is that? It's a night striker. I can't even see him. Oh, dude, there's a whole swarm! And a bear! I'll punch the bear to death. That's not working. I <laughs> did that's it. <laughs> Just, oh, I got it. Let's go. How is this bear still alive? Damn. That was a battle royale right there. Damn. <laughs> I'm surprised I survived that. The bear was too busy trying to kill the bees or whatever. Ramen's just running from something. Holy moly. Okay, I'll go and quick save here. I need to get some kind of progress saved. I already have 50 deaths in this entire playthrough. Wow. That's a lot. What is this thing? Hmm. Ooh. Ooh. We got the grenade launcher. Let's go. That's so satisfying. Thook, 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 thook. I love that sound, man. That's what I'm saying. This is another Modern Warfare gun. Ported on over from uh, either Modern Warfare 2 or Modern Warfare 1. Same thing. Literally the same fucking game, just with a different number. Anyway, amazing animations and sounds. Just listen to that. Doom, 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 doom. So good. Uh oh. There might be a bear in it. Right, what the fuck is that? Oh, it's a waste wolf. A little baby waste wolf. Okay. I just killed him and Bambi. Damn! Well, I've not seen that gore before. Look at that. Its jaw is all fucked up. Nice. Oh, well, look. I got the Christmas special. The cute little gun. I got the Christmas lights on it. Not that effective against Mario Lakes. Nope. Okay. There we go. I killed him. Ooh, Thunderstick. Let me find something. <clears throat> Like a ghoul over here, I can kill this thing. Oh yeah, see, this ghoul's right there. Nice. Ooh, one shot. Easy. Guver, let's go. Ooh, flamethrower. Finally. Whoosh. I'm gonna destroy this feral child. Oh, no, there's a liquor on my ass. Don't worry, I have the diamond sword. Yeah. Oh. What is this guy? What the hell? Oh, what the? F oh my god, my game's freezing up. Oh, too much going on. Yeah, there's just too much going on. My crash logs aren't working for some reason. Usually, like it tells me like what. Um. <laughs> yeah. Usually my crash like shows up and it tells me which mod caused the crash, but it's not working. The crashes are that crazy now. I think the main thing is just too many enemies. There's like 
20 different enemies all next to each other and plus the the randomizer too is probably messing with it because like it's too many scripts so even though i changed my memory back to what it was it's still crashing around the same rate i'd say um it hasn't made a huge difference because we got four crashes in so far today like uh on friday i had eight in total it's like i'm not even sure if i want to um commit to this playthrough for too long because with the randomizer included it just i don't know man i don't i don't know how to make the randomizer stable with all my other mods i'll try and just get to, I'll, I'll kill kellogg at least i need to kill it i need to at least kill kellogg for now i'm just gonna push on through and uh, i'll do some more testing and see if i can somehow make it more stable but it just seems like the randomizer makes my game more crash heavy too much going on at once you know like all the Especially when like there's a bunch of enemies in one spot and I'm constantly switching between weapons. You know, I feel like that's too stressful in the game's engine. It still works, but much more prone to crashing. Which is unfortunate. It's just something you gotta deal with if you wanna do heavily modded Fallout 4. Especially if you're messing around with experimental mods like this one. This guy said Bethesda is crashing your game purposely after your Starfield video. That's facts. That's fact. T Todd is mad at me. You know. He doesn't want me playing with all these mods. Because pl me playing with all these mods implies that Fallout 4 isn't good as... Like, isn't good out of the box. It's not good vanilla. So. Todd only wants you to play Fallout 4 vanilla. Or with Creation Club mods. Because obviously Creation Club mods are god tier. Uh oh. This guy wasn't here last time. Uh oh. 44 Magnum against Metal Armor. Not the best matchup. But it's still. He's got a lot of health. He's not doing much damage, though. I'll shoot his eyeballs off. Then he can't aim. This guy's still not dead. Are you kidding me? I shot both of his eyeballs off. Come on now. That thing was just so tanky. Little fun fact, if you guys didn't know, the eyeballs and the Mr. Handies are their weak spot. Pretty interesting. There's the alien. And there's the flashbang. Cool. Let me try him. Oh, okay. This will be good to kill the, the Mr. Gutsy if he spawns in this time. It might be a random enemy. He's not here this time. Okay. That's interesting. Whatever. Yeah. Completely random. Okay. Nice. That was a really spooky howl if y'all heard that. What the fuck? That was a boom bug. He broke my armor plate. I still have him, right? Am I out of armor plates? I might want to go home and craft some before I go any further then, actually. Yeah, okay. I'll stop. I'll go back to Red Rocket and craft some armor plates because I definitely want those before going into. Um, whatchamacallit. Hold on. Let me make sure I have a fast travel marker. Where am I? Where the fuck am I? Hello? I don't know, but. I can at least walk over to Jamaica. Uh, this isn't Jamaica Plain. Forest Grove Marsh and get that fast travel marker. I'll get that first. Do you do death metal vocals? Yeah. Not like... I mean, yeah. I don't really listen to too much death metal. I'm more of a fan of metalcore and deathcore. But yeah, I, I do the same... I do the same rough vocals, yeah. Which is funny. It's just funny how people can just tell I'm... Like, I... I do that kind of stuff. Especially, like, if I... You know, get mad and yell or something. You, you can just feel like the... You can just, oh, I got the crowbar right there. I think that was the first time I got the crowbar. Crowbar's cool. Anyway. Especially if I do the, you know... Ugh! You can just hear it right there. What did I get? Did I get the shuriken or something? I got the shuriken. Okay. Nice. It didn't kill him, though. Now I gotta punch him. Okay. Missed at point blank. 
Now we get the nerf gun, baby. Let's go. That's what we were waiting for. <laughs> oh no. I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh! <laughs> the feral tank. Oh no. I gotta find I gotta find something weak. Please. Please. I'm I'm dead. I'm already dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. POV, you have alerted the horde. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Ugh. One more death. I need to I need to do another quick save. Like closer. I'm way back here again. This is such a brutal playthrough though. So I'm gonna get something stupid like the nerf gun. It's just almost almost always a guaranteed death. Almost. I have gotten kills with it a, a couple times, but other than that, man, you're pretty much screwed. Especially if you got the whole freaking feral horde on your butt. Good luck with that. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, well, look at that. Oh! Oh, this will work. Oh, my! Oh! I think my shotguns might be bugged, because that was crazy. That was actually absurd. Dude, did you see all the numbers on my screen? I mean, I, it was it was two headshots, to be fair. It was headshots. But that was way too quick. On a feral tank, I just two-shotted him. Like the amount of the amount of numbers on my screen was like it was like 50 pellets or something crazy. So I think there might be some kind of bug with like the shotgun projectile. It's like the it's like there's like 50 projectiles in the shotguns for some reason. So um I might want to check that out cuz that was bugged. There's no way. That's definitely not intended. That is not the intended damage. <laughs> there's a whole party going on over here. Oh, this is full auto, of course. What is this? Is this shooting 9mm? I love how my screen was blocked out by my freaking backpack. <laughs> oh no. 9mm is not going to be very effective against this freaking hard shell, so I should uh, run away and come back later. Who puts a scope on an SMG? That's so goofy. Not. Something's wrong with the damage on this one, too. Yeah, the range is bugged. The range says 44. That's why I'm doing, like, barely any damage. This should be this should be doing, you know, base damage is 28. But I'm doing actually 5 damage. See, that's why the floating damage mod is really nice to have. The floating damage mod, um... It tells you how much damage you're actually doing. Like, even though this gun says 28, it's not actually doing 28. It's doing fucking 5 damage. Because, number one, the range is bugged. The range should be, like, at least 100 or something. Like, this gun has an effective range of, like, 10 feet, basically. So I need to fix this. And also, you also have to think about um, damage resistance. Because damage resistance will lower this number to about, like, normally about 20. Or 22. You know? So it should be doing around 20-something damage, but it's doing 5 because it's bugged out. So I'll, f I'll fix that. I'll still get a kill with it, though. Oh. So I still I got a fucking paddle ball. Okay, he's, he's low, though. I can kill him. I just want to kill him with, with the actual paddles. Got him. Let's go. <laughs> okay. See, that was... The numbers you saw on the shotgun, it seems like too too many pellets. Like, how many pellets was that? That, that felt like it was like 20. 20 pellets, you know? Uh, so I might have to fix that as well. Something with the shotguns are bugged. So I've noticed throughout my entire playthrough, it seems like the shotguns are like really powerful. Nice. Nice. Oh. Of course. I'm I'm dead. I'm literally dead. I can't kill this guy. It does no damage. Yeah. And now there's a freaking werewolf on me. Does this even do one damage? Like it still shows their health bars. Like, let me see. 160. It it literally does no damage. I'm done. I'm dead. I might as well die. Maybe I should take this gun out of the out of the out of the randomizer because the fact that it does zero damage means it's literally just a guaranteed death. You know.
So maybe I should, maybe I should just take it out. Or at least, maybe I should, if I can make it to where, like, it spawns in as the grenade launcher variant, that'd be cool. It is pretty funny, though. I mean, it's, it's kind of silly. Because, you know, at least with the paddle ball, the paddle ball and the nerf gun, they do one damage. So, like, you're kind of screwed, but you could still get a kill with them. As you saw earlier, I, I was able to kill that one feral brute by just banging him with the paddle ball. So, like, I was able to get a kill with it. It's unfair, but it's still possible. The Thirst Zapper, though, literally does zero damage, even if you're bashing, so that needs to get fixed. You know? Either I'll take it out completely, or I'll, um, try and make it to where it spawns in as, like, the the Nuka-Cola grenade launcher variant. That'd be, that'd be funny. That would make it really powerful, though. Oh, fuck. I was like, I was like, why is there a shadow hitting me? It's a Nightkin. Scared the hell out of me. There we go. Nope, dog me just got hit. Nice. This 9mm is not very effective. Like, it's m mutant skulls. So, like, as you can see, he's. It does 14 damage, right? 55 on a headshot. But the actual gun does 28 damage. Is, is he wearing metal armor? He's wearing a... What the fuck? Another Nightkin? I can't see him. I'm being gang stalked by the CIA! What the hell? I can't even see him. Okay, I got... <laughs> bro was a CIA agent, bro. I couldn't see him. Whoa. There's a floating chunk of meat on my screen. That looks tasty. <laughs> nightmare, nightmare, nightmare! <laughs> <laughs> Every single time, dude, there needs to be a mod for that. Whenever a nightkin shows up, he just needs to scream, Nightmare, Nightmare, Nightmare! <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Dude. <laughs> okay, I'll do a quick save here. Holy moly. Remember to put on armor plates, yeah. Like I said, my goal, I just want to get to Jamaica Plain, or Forest Grove Marsh, so I can get the fast travel marker, and then I'll fast travel back. To red rocket and then craft armor plates and then come back but so far i've died every single time i've tried so maybe i should just go there now maybe i'll just run over there and then run away i think that's the strat because i don't have to kill any of these guys i can just run past them but i just like killing things you know that's the whole point of the run you gotta use the randomizer i can play fast shovel from this spot let me see nope not that one this one there we go yep there we go Oh my goodness. This is truly nightmare difficulty though. It's still hard. I'm still dying quite often. It's not as hard as it was on part on like the first stream, but it ain't easy either. That's for damn sure. God damn. I don't know why I keep on calling that place Jamaica Plain. It's Forest Grove Marsh, bro. I got the, the stuff mixed up in my mind. It's fine. Oh sweet, I got enough for heavy plates. That's dope. Yeah, let me craft. I can either craft one batch of heavy plates or I can craft two batches of medium plates. Huh. I don't know. I think I'd rather just craft two batches of medium plates so you just have more. I think, I might, I think that might be better in the long run, honestly. I think I'll just go for that. Or I could craft a buttload of... I can craft five batches of small plates. I want to do it that way, but I think I'd just rather craft two. Oh wait, I don't have enough screws in there anyway. Oh, okay. Well then, I'll just craft medium and small plates then. And just buy more shipments. Yeah, I need more screws though. So for now, I'm fine. Medium plates are still fine, as long as you have something on. It, it doesn't like it, even if you have a small plate, it makes a big difference. It makes a very noticeable difference. You know, so I think it's better to have to have simply more quantity, because like I think they still have the same amount of health though, or it's about the same. Should also go buy some more healing items. I don't have very many. I only got three. Or I could craft some, craft more bandages at least. Now my night vision turned on. Oh yeah, I totally forgot. I'm using a night vision helmet, huh? Because there's night vision on the on the helmet. If you, if you guys didn't see that. Um. 
I can't turn it off. What the fuck? Oh, it's B. Look at that. You can you can see it. You can see it move too, which is very immersive. Look how immersive that is. You can see the night vision goggles go up and go down. Anyway, I need healing. I craft a bunch of these. Oh, I don't want that one. Whoops. I want the. Uh... Oh, doctor's bag will be useful. Oh, that's super useful. Nice. That heals you all the way. Okay. Um, anyway. So, yeah. I'll sound good now. I'm good on, on, on healing. Three doctor's bags. Doctor bags. This heals your entire health bar. Bandages. A couple stem packs. Okay. There we go, baby. Armor. Wait. Armor plates are... Okay, yeah, there it is. Now I can go back. Forest Grove Marsh. <laughs> what do you all say? Okay. Oh. I do not want to check the time. What gun am I even using here? Okay, the M14? I think that's right. I'm dude, you can spam the trigger on this thing. God dang. They go fast. You can it's almost full auto at this point. That's crazy. I'm missing most of my shots, so. Yeah, I got him. Nice. Okay, there's too many ghouls on me right now. There we go. Ooh, fat man. That'll be useful. <laughs> oh. That's unfortunate. Okay, this one actually does have a crash log, though. Let me see. What crashed the game? And that fat man was so effective, it crashed my whole fucking game. <laughs> M's abominations? What? How did that crash my game? That's weird. I don't want to uninstall that mod though. That's... Huh. M's abominations crash my game somehow. There, there's some kind of conflict. I don't know. Just seems like the randomizer conflicts with fucking everything. Because ever since I installed this mod... The singular mod. The Glowing Sea playthrough was fine. I've had more crashes. I literally had more crashes in the f in the first stream than I did for the entire Glowing Sea playthrough. So. I don't know, man. Obviously, I'm not going to blame the mod author of the randomizer. Obviously, he did not intend for someone, for some buffoon like me to pump 600 mods in into the game and make it work with the randomizer. The, obviously that's going to cause problems, and I knew this going in, but I still wanted to try it. It's still somewhat playable, just with a lot of crashing. <laughs> Proving that no, my PC would not survive shooting a fat man. Yeah. <laughs> Holy moly. I'll keep on trying, man. I just want to push through and at least get to kill Kellogg, man, before I before I stop this playthrough. Because on, at this point, at this point, I don't know if I if I want to finish the game with this many crashes. I really don't feel like it. I feel like it's too um, it's too annoying. It's too uh, what do you call it? I don't know. Disruptive. There you go. That's a good word. It's too disruptive. You know. That's my one goal. I at least got to shoot Kellogg in the face with the with the rainbow gun or something. There's got to be some kind of funny gun. That's my goal. Crashes are very immersive. Yeah. Oh, hundred percent. You know, I could just say screw these guys and just run over there. You know, that would make my game less likely to crash. I assume. Stop punching me. Thank you. See ya. Alert. 
And critical signs. Shut up. Goofy our robot. Where's dog meat at? I thought he was following me. The fuck? That's goofy. Oh no, this guy said crashes are unimmersive. Whoops, I misread that. That's unfortunate. Yeah, there's a death claw. I'll just uh run around that one. No thank you. I'm 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 on a mission, bro. I gotta get this over with. A giant blast ball. What the Don't worry about it. How's the run going? It's going all right. It's working somewhat. As you can see, the crash counter is pretty high. Um, but I'm still able to progress through the game somewhat. Oh, Lord. Holy moly. Okay, this gear's got to go. <laughs> He's dead. Uh, that, that dude was chasing me down, bro. He was angry. Oof. Sniped him. Is that a UFO? Oh yeah, I was. I should go into the roof. I think the roof is the. Uh -oh. Or no. Maybe going through the garage is the best way. Like, there's less encounters at the garage, I think. I mean, either way. I'm already down here, so I might as well go into this way. Yeah, I'm already right here, so. Might as well. Why is there just a Glock and balls in the floor? What the fuck? That's weird. Wow. Which direction am I supposed to go? Oh, hello. Bro got riddled. Oh, sweet. I got the minigun. Let's go. We got the Ash Maker one uh, specifically. That's pretty cool. Yeah, how do I get around this? I forgot. Let me just shoot through the wall. Okay, that's not working. Jeez. Okay, he shot me through the wall, though. That's cool. God dang it, Bobby. Bruh. This is a certified bruh moment. Whoa! I'm not... That's very realistic. <laughs> You ever seen videos of like that where like sometimes the gun just goes off by itself? You know? Yeah, trigger jam, yeah. The gun jammed on me, bro. <laughs> that was crazy. Especially with a shit ass pipe gun like this. That 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 would most likely happen at some point. That's very lower accurate, yeah. You got Al you got Alec Baldwin. <laughs> very immersive. That was that was super immersive. Honestly though, that would actually be cool if like if there was a game out there that had, uh, you know, jams like that. Really, when it comes down to it, I can't think of any other game besides Fallout New Vegas that has weapon jams. Oh, oh no, Far Cry 2! Far Cry 2 had weapon jams, actually. But other than that, I can't think of a single other game that has weapon jams. Can you all name any? This is doing piss poor damage. Six damage? Seriously? I should be doing- wait. Oh my lord. Oh no, I meant to use a stim pack. I'm just... Okay, I'm dead. Sheesh. Yeah, for some reason the MP7 was doing really bad. Six damage per shot? It should be piercing armor. So I need to fix that one too. So I need to fix... I need to write this down. I need to fix... Uh, the AR9 from the service rifle mod. I need to fix that one. I need to fix the MP7 not penetrating armor. Not penetrating synth metal bodies. Because it should be doing more like 20 something damage, not 6 damage. E even if they're made of metal, you know, it's armor piercing ground. Right? Very, very immersive. Is someone 
Now, this gun doing low damage against armor makes sense because it's 380. 380 is not armor penetrating, you know. <laughs> Little PPK. This is not going to be very effective against robots either. Obviously. Is my plate even on? I don't even know if I have a plate on. I'm getting melted right now. I think I'm just going to get melted either way, man. Sheesh. Oh, wait. I just replaced it again. Whoops. Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm probably going to die here anyway, so... You know, it doesn't matter. Yeah. See? At least the laser gun... It doesn't one-shot me anymore. Yeah, I might as well just die here, honestly. Just, I can't even shoot through these stupid pipes. Ah, oh, six damage. That's, pre that's pretty good. Yeah, this fucking sucks. <laughs> oh, Daisy. Okay, that's a good one. I haven't played Daisy. That's why. Okay. That's why I didn't know. That's pretty cool. Okay. Um, let's try this again. Do I even have Stimpax hotkey? I, don't, I think the hotkey broke on it or something. No, it's, it's still there. I just wasn't able to use it for some reason. Okay. How, how good is my plate, by the way? It says slightly damaged, so it's, it's fine. Quick save. Sheesh. It's this door. Oh, wait, no, this goes to the other... Dude. I got another submachine gun. Please, just give me like a freaking Barrett 50 cal. I want to one-shot these dudes. That'd be great. Oh, fiberglass. Do that. I'm going to make armor plates out of telephones. This one does... Ooh, concrete. Oh, no. I Oh, I'm going to die. Dude. Oh, yeah, I'm dead. Yeah. You know, just just keep on trying, I guess. <laughs> Those laser guns are still good. They're still good. I would say they're balanced. I would say the laser gun's balanced now. What do you guys think? Like, it's it kills me fairly quick. But at, at the same time, I'm standing right in front of him. And he's mowing me down with a laser gun. So, I mean, I think it's balanced now. It can still shred through me. But then again, it's a laser gun. It's going to shred through you. It's not going to one-shot you, though. That, that, that just would be unbalanced. Like, yeah. It's, it's, it's still on the powerful side, though. As you can tell, it's still on the powerful side. Um, whew. It almost killed me there. I was still able to win a gunfight using a pipe gun, though. Oh, I got another pipe gun. That's hilarious. I'm just getting shit-ass pipe guns back-to-back. -back. Not very effective against robots. As you can see, very little damage. But it's still able to kill him. Okay, crossbow. Okay. Ooh. Almost a one shot. Nice. Ooh, there we go. Can I shoot? Ah. Oh, it's the freaking reload bug. Um, I don't know why I replaced my. I'm pressing the wrong hotkeys. I'm flustered right now. I was going to say. I couldn't shoot there because of the reload bug. If you uh, if you shoot a certain weapon that has a long reload time, and then you switch to another one, you can't shoot from that gun you just switched to until the reload time from the previous gun is done. So the reload on the crossbow takes a few seconds, right? So I can't shoot any gun for like another like three seconds, or however long it takes to reload it. The, the same thing, it's very apparent when you use something like a missile launcher as well. Like a missile launcher with a high reload time on it. That's something that, that that's just unfortunately a part of this run. I can't really get rid of, get rid of it. It's just part of the, the game. It's hard coded into Fallout 4. This dude had a freaking PK. Bro. I'm just getting... Why am I only getting low caliber weapons? Exclusively getting machine pistols and SMGs. Okay. I had a mag dumping twice. Okay, finally I got a rifle. This will be slightly, slightly better, at least. Sheesh. A little bit better. Okay, now a machine gun. That's good. That's good. That's better. Uh oh. I'll get them both down to low health. Oh. 
Nice. Okay, G3. That's good. I got the fucking Thirst Sapper. I'm dead. I'm actually dead. I, need to, I, just, I should take this out of the game at this point, actually. I'm dead. Zero damage. <laughs> just, okay, just kill me. Kill me! He's me! He can't hit me! He's that- What? <laughs> he was missing. He was bugging out. Bruh. Bruh. <laughs> Bro had that stormtrooper aim for like half- For like- For like a couple seconds there. Ugh. That's funny. Okay, I can get through here eventually. I'll go through this at some point. <laughs> Give me those rations. Give me those rations. I can't open it. Oh. Okay, I got it. Never mind. You know what I should do? I just sold that alcohol. That just gave me a good idea. Honey, where's my keys? Oh, yeah. No, I don't think I need vodka to increase my health. No, whatever. Uh, where's my Where's my drugs? I need more buff out. I'll take Psycho, sure. Medic, sure. I'm taking all the drugs. Okay, I'm taking all the drugs, baby. You already know how it is. I guess that helps. Whoa! That melee animation was crazy. I got a freaking Bowie knife. Ow. Ooh, one shot. That was crazy. Best weapon in the game, baby. Are you kidding me? There's three of them. Nice. Ooh, a deagle. Nice. Dude, okay, yeah. The shotguns are bugged. Did you see how many numbers there were on the screen? There was like 20 pellets. That's not... That's... Okay. Unless this thing's using birdshot, but birdshot's not gonna be that powerful. I need to fix that. Shotguns are OP. <laughs> shotguns are actually OP in my game right now. Something's bugged. It's all shotguns, too, which is weird. All of them. Did I just get the assault run head twice? What the hell? That's crazy. Ow. Dude, these lasers are eating me alive. I got the fucking throwing shoe. I got the throwing shoe. Are you kidding me? That's hilarious. I can I can kill him. Let me at least try and knock off his other arm. There you know. So I can punch it off. <laughs> oh, okay. Ah, oh, whatever. I wanted to finish him with the throwing shoe, but whatever. I didn't realize how, how deadly my fists were. My fists are just so powerful, you know? <laughs> Jeesh. That was quick. Seriously? Sledgehammer. Again. That's hilarious. Okay. What is... Dogmeat's just chilling. Um... Pick up some junk, why not? Get some screws. Screws and fiberglass and There's still one guy over here. No, they're upstairs actually. I can just skip them. Screw them. I'm out of here. Hmm. <laughs> Imagine <laughs> killing Kellogg with his shoe. Yeah. That'd be funny. I'll have to try and do that. I'll see if I can get a food pie. If I can get a if I or get like a the pink like paste pie or whatever it's called. Throw that at Kellogg and kill him that way. Well, that would be rather comical, I must say. Where's my armor plate at? My armor plate's actually broken. Okay. That explains a lot. Okay, that's a shortcut. I forgot. Uh oh. Ooh. Ow. Oh, nice. What? Two mini guns in a row? What are the chances? What are the chances? Like, actually. Yeah, this little trap is pretty bad. That combo was crazy, yeah. Straight from Tesla cannon into a minigun into another minigun. That is lucky. Watch, and then I'm gonna get, like, nerf gun, then finger gun, then throwing shoe back to back to back. Ooh, SV-98. That's good. 
Let's go, baby. Sorry, your house has been a wreck for two. Oh yeah. <laughs> you did not say rather comical. I did say that. What do you mean? It's a perfectly fine phrase to say. The sound is so beautiful. Okay, Karambit. Okay, that's interesting. I could charge this guy. Don't worry about. It. Maybe not. Ow. The glorious XM5. I got the big boy. Oh boy. Where's it at? Hello? Where is it? Apparently the big boy is now a punt gun. <laughs> 600 damage. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, baby. <laughs> the big boy is a punt gun, bro. <laughs> That's hilarious. I wanted I wanted to destroy um Kellogg with this thing. Just as the founding fathers intended. Look how stu look how oversized this thing is, bro. It's so funny how big this thing is. They're even bigger in real life too. You're pissed off. I get it. I do. Absolutely crazy sound on that it's thing. And an anti material right. rifle right after that. Is it Hello? Can I shoot? There we go. Back to back? Oh, okay, this one's the this one's the Ventores. I went straight from a Valon to a Ventores. That's funny. Ow, 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 ow. Go. Oh my lord. Don't mind me. I should probably just take a doctor's bag at this point. <laughs> Not a good idea. Whew. I should probably wait to heal, actually. What is, what is my armor plate at? It's broken. Okay, that's why. I'm like, this this dude's helping me too quick. Invisible play, let's go. Just a, do a rainbow six corner peek. There we go. I got the fucking nerf gun, dude. I got the nerf gun. Are you kidding me? I'm not going to kill anything with this thing. That's just not happening. Oh. oh boy. I'll try. I'll try. It's 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 it's, it's, it's semi auto too. It's even worse. Okay. If I sit in this corner, it's actually doing zero damage. It's doing zero damage because the damage resistance is too high on that thing. I have to punch it. Five damage, I'm gonna die. Yeah. Yeah, it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. I could try maybe killing these synths that spawn in. Maybe that'll work. An enemy may be utilizing stealth. How interesting. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I'll, I was dead anyway, man. It's nerf or nothing, man. Apparently it was nothing this time. <laughs> it was a whole bunch of nothing. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. It's really unfortunate, man. Like, you can still get kills with a nerf gun if you kill, like, a bug or something. But against robots, man, that ain't happening. That, that is just not gonna happen. I did put in death right Yeah, I did. Damn. Oh, yeah, I need to put on the armor plate. Good. Goodness gracious. How did you die with the best gun in the game? <laughs> I just skill issue. Melts. Oh, he moved. Throwing shoe. Okay, let's heal up. Let's go kill this stupid turret with a throwing shoe, I guess. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, no, there's a sin. Oh, I'm dead. I might as well just die. I might as well just die, bro. See, through this section, I'm just gonna have to get lucky. I'm, I'm just gonna have to get lucky with some good weapons, man. <laughs> There's no way I can get through this with a... I typed in death wrong. <laughs> uh. Oh my goodness. Okay, M60 is really good. I can't... Re hold on. Oh, wait a second. Ah! This fucking 
game, man. Look at the thirst zapper <laughs> that my game crashes. <laughs> Bruh. That was just insult to injury. It's fucking gay, man. What, what caused the crash? Okay, there's a crash log. Metro Gear Mask? What? It mentioned Metro Gear Mask and Fallout 4 ESM, so... I don't know what the deal is with that one. Something to do with my gas mask caused the crash, maybe? I just don't see that. I don't see how that how that happened. The game was rigged from the start. Worldwide Ghouls is mentioned in there as well? That makes no sense. I'm on the interior. I don't know, man. Some of these crashes are just completely random. These, these, like, these crash logs don't make any sense. They really don't make any sense, because... I don't know, man. Maybe, maybe my crash log is randomized, too. Maybe the randomizer is randomizing my crash logs. That, that's the only thing that, that makes sense. The randomizer in general just seems to be causing a bunch of issues with my game. I'm still going to push through. I'm going to kill Kellogg at the very least. Okay, I might not finish the game with this randomizer, but I'm going to kill Kellogg with him at, 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 the, at the least. Okay. Ugh. I did put crash in there. It's 14 crashes in total is really bad. That's not good. That is pretty stinky. You can see the crash kind of right there. I put it there for a reason because I, you know, I'm playing modded Fallout 4. Of course it's going to crash a bunch. Yeah, I insulted the thirst zapper so the game crashed. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Ah! <sighs> it's just getting frustrating for real. No, I don't want to start a new game. <laughs> well, I kind of do want to start a new game at this point. Fuck. Hello? Oh, yeah, I'm only four hours into the game so far. Four hours? Um. 59 deaths and 14 crashes in 4 hours is pretty brutal. Bonk. Of course it's single fire. Still works though. Ooh, shy attack M200 intervention. I missed. That's embarrassing. Nice. 400 damage. Oh, that's a big headshot. Anyway. It would appear my target has which, where did he go? Did he just crouch it? That's a lot of lasers. I should back up and heal. Jeez. That dude just kept spamming around the corner. Anyway. Don't mind if I do. Ow. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, I shot it. Okay, there we go. I shot his arms off. That's hilarious. Nice. I came in clutch. Whew. Okay. I didn't want to waste my time lock picking. I just want to get through this. I just want to kill these losers. I don't even need it right away. I don't care. I'm just I'm just gonna run to the end of this point. I'm just gonna I can't see. Ah. Doctor's back, screw it. That animation looks so funny. If you crouch, if you crouch and use a bandage and then stand up, it like bugs out the animation where you use your gun to wrap your hand, which is really silly. My goodness. I have it. I wonder how many bullets in total my character has eaten, or how many lasers as well. Ow. Like, that was like three hits. I'm already one HP. Handmade anti-material rifle. Okay. I'm getting some getting some decent rolls at this point, actually. And a minigun? Nice. That's pretty good. I might. I get to kill Kelly with a minigun. Let's go, baby. This is gonna be so easy. This is gonna be stupid easy. Let's go. Unfortunately. For everyone looking forward to me killing Kellogg with a with a bad weapon, 
you, yeah, you ain't getting that because I got a minigun. I got a motherfucking minigun. Let's go, that. baby. I sense you're standing down. Let's talk. Open the door. Oh, finally. Lady Luck is on my side for this one. I got a freaking minigun to kill Kellogg. He's dead. And a plasma caster. Hello? And a PPSH? Nice. Good pulls. I did it. I finally got it. I finally got the bastard. Oh, I, got, I just got lucky that time. I just got lucky. I would have not been able to kill this guy with a nerf gun. There's no way. That would have been impossible. I got super... Like, I pulled the, the plasma caster and then the PPSH right after that. Pretty solid. Pretty solid, man. That was good. That was... Yeah, that was too easy. That was way too easy. For all the suffering I've been through, man, I think I deserve an easy win at this point, you know? But you are right. That was a little bit too easy. I mean, I'm using a damn minigun. What'd you expect? Well, hold on, you know. It was 10 o'clock. Damn, I need, I'm getting hungry, too. I need to go eat. I need to go buy buy Borgar. I need to use all my donation money to fund my burger burger addiction. <laughs> you know? <laughs> you really just emptied the compartments of his pantaloons. <laughs> I'm more like I filled his body with 762 by 51 NATO. You know? <laughs> Kellogg's liberal bones couldn't deflect American rounds. <laughs> and his liberal bones couldn't stand the might of 762 at freaking 3,000 rounds per minute. You know? <laughs> That's funny. Whew. Turn off the turrets. Deactivate. Yeah. There might be still... Yeah, there's still a couple up there. What's the gun I'm using? Oh, the Deagle. Yeah. Good animations on this thing. Can it, did I open it? Hello? Open door. Thank you. Okay, there we go. There it is! I'm gonna shoot at him. Ah, they don't care. Anyway, there we got one, one more donation there. Oh, it's from Dex again with the two Robux. Thank you very much, Dex, for the two Robux. Really appreciate it. He said, congrats on the victory royale. Have Robux for Bunger. For Bunger? <laughs> Bro said Bunger. That's funny. Thank you very much, Dex. Anyway, the game just randomly gave me two more weapons. I don't know if that's part of the randomizer mod or what. But I'll go back to the Deagle for now. Or did it did it steal it from me, actually? Let me see. Okay, I think it actually, it actually traded out my weapon. I guess that's part of the mod. So, like, once you complete a main story quest, maybe it just gives you another random weapon. It's weird. But yeah, it, it automatically equipped the AA-12, so I guess I'll go with that for now. That's cool. I, that's pretty good. Oh, now we showed up. That's funny. Okay. Hello? I can't run for some reason. Oh, I'm over encumbered from the, um... My alcohol wore, wore out. There we go. Alright. I completed my objective for the night. So that's good. Victory is now mine. <laughs> I'm gonna go home. Back to Red Rocket. Take a freaking nap. That was rather brutal. Holy moly. So, I'm not sure if I'm gonna continue this run for much longer. Um... Just because it crashes so much. I definitely do want to come back and try it again with e with a different set of random weapons. Maybe something, e stuff even more goofier. But I think for now, I'll stop here for now. Um, just for my sanity because there's just too much crashing going on. I'll see, I'll, I'll see if I can figure out a way to make it less crash prone. But it seems like it just crashes no matter what I try. You know, it's too random. Explosive only run. Maybe. Maybe I could just, like, a randomizer with only explosives. That'd be dope. Grab all this stuff off. Nice. Easy dub, boys. Take a big fat nap. Why not? 
We got one more donut over there. Let's go. Dude, a lot of donations, man. That's crazy. Holy moly. Those are from God's Helix with the five euros. He said, I really love these streams. I'd love to see them become a more regular thing. I agree. I agree. I definitely want to do these more often as well. But, um, you know. It just takes a lot of setup, especially with me just trying to get my game working properly. And you know, me working on videos as well. I definitely want to keep doing them as, as often as I can, though. I see now it pops up. They still have a lot of issues, especially like the overlay being delayed. It's kind of goofy. Kind of silly goofy. <sighs> but anyways, thank you again for the five euros there. Really appreciate it. Thank you very much to everyone who donated tonight. Keeps me going. Supporting the channel is very nice. That means I can afford to fund my burger addiction. <laughs> but alright guys. I think I'll go ahead and um, make a little video out of this. I'll, also, I need to finish up the... Um, I needed the Starfield Guns Part 2. I need to work on that as well. We're getting... Like I said, that's all for now. Y'all have a good night. And I'll see y'all next time. Yeah, I'm gonna turn this shit off. Okay, bye. Beautiful night.